What's good, everyone? Welcome to the Slope Podcast. It's our weekly podcast on Sakamichi Series Idols. Noki Zaka, hey. Kiaki Zaka, Hinata Zaka, and Ooh. Yoshimoto Zaka, the only one that matters. I'm Boy, and I'm joined by Jimmy and Josh. As always, every week, God damn it! How are you guys? Oh, what's up, guys? So, I was saving this story. I wanted to say it on Discord, but I was like, no. This is a story for the show. Mm. Something happened with the fourth gens? Tell thy I, I story. So I mentioned earlier during the pre-show that uh, I was at my grandmother's physical therapy session today. Right? Okay. And then uh, the the girl, like the physical therapy assistant that was like working with my grandma, super cute. And then, uh, what is it? I looked at her name tag. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And then I saw the last name Shida, and I got hella sad. <laughs> well, it was a, a it was a quick double take kind of thing because it was actually Nishida, uh, you know. Mm-hmm. But then I just saw mm-hmm. the Shida. Like, <laughs> Monica, <laughs> yeah, dude, think, almost, did you think did you think there was a chance, maybe a chance that it could have been her? <laughs> no, no, it wasn't that. Just it was just like all the all the memories just came flooding over me. What you know? is she doing in California suddenly? <laughs> suddenly in California, a physical therapy assistant. I'm like, wow, you got your, your two-year certification so quickly. Uh-huh. Graduated Kayaki Zaka a few months ago, and now you're already a, you already got your cert, huh? Break kid, break kid. Yeah, I'm just oh, holding on to my grandma's little gate belt, helping her up and down, walking up and down stairs, just crying. Like <laughs> Grandma's like, oh, Jimmy. I'm <laughs> sorry you have to you care keep for, You care me. for me after you all. You care <laughs> so much. No, he's just crying about someone else. Yeah, no, Grandma, I just... I miss my first Kea Oshi, dude. <laughs> She's like, what? Uh, it's funny, because, like, I can't tell her any of, like, uh, the... Like, how, how, how much I like any of this Japanese stuff. Because she's still kind of like low key racist against like Japan from World War Two. Oh shit! <laughs> like every now and then, I I I'm, rem- I'm reminded of like how old she is, and I'm like, ooh, can't 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 talk about this. Mm. So so uh, has she seen your posters then? Huh? Has she seen your posters? No, actually, she hasn't. Now that I, now that I come to think of it, mm. yeah, she doesn't okay. like come into my bedroom very often, you know. Mm. She gets to the house and she like sits in the living room because she's old and she's like, I'm I'm not moving from this point. <laughs> <laughs> I have anyways, that was my story. I almost uh I almost teared up at a, a grandma's physical just remembering the simpler times, dude. There was a, supposedly some stalker pictures of Suzumo, oh, no. Suzumoto and Shida. Ooh. They went to eat out together. Mm-hmm. But it was Un- unconfirmed mm. it was like the the pictures were like super blurry and you can't even yeah tell. from a distance you, like people I mean, just it, guessed it was suzumoto because of her hair color or whatever mm. i mean it, it very well could have been them for all we know right but it's just like this picture does me no good yeah right? I mean, like, like, also this like, doesn't satisfy me the members yeah, in yeah. the the members in the blogs would be like oh yeah i went to eat with blah 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 you know they would say mm. stuff like that so it's like mm-hmm. Yeah, I mean, like, I, it's like half the time you get a stalker picture, it's like super grainy and blurry. It's from mm. like, you know, it's all this digital zoom because they took it with their phone from like a distance. And then uh-huh. it's like, they, they have a face mask on anyways. I'm like, what does this do me? This isn't, I get nothing out of this. Okay, mm. cool. You saw them. Yeah. So if you're taking stalker photos, stop it. No one cares. It doesn't do anything for anybody. <laughs> Unless you have like a now 7200. If, now, if you're one of those. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Have, have a hell tele- teleconverter in there, you know. No, all I want is the the selfies from the blogs, dude. Those, those bring me joy. Mm. Mm. Who knows if we're going to get those or not. But. Yeah. I, I Anyways, bet the members will keep that to themselves. It's mm. like, hey man, she out the game, dude. Keep her out mm-hmm. the game. That's true. That's why she doesn't have an Instagram or Twitter, right? Probably has a private one. Oh yeah. Mm-hmm. Who doesn't have social media nowadays? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. I mean, there's no rule keeping her from having social media anymore. So mm-hmm. for a young, sense. however old she is, twenty, twenty year old. Mm-hmm. I don't know. Whatever. Anyway, um, Josh, how you been? <laughs> I forgot we're still in the segment. Uh, good. 
Good. Um, I got. I got. It's not forty six related, but I got this recently. The Yo, that looks whack. super good, man. It's like a lot of like the whack photo black and white kind of stuff. Mm. It's like if you like flip through real quick, if you see it's all like mostly black and white with a couple color. That's like one of the rare photo books you can keep out on the coffee table and you won't mm-hmm. get judged for. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. There's a couple pages in here you might get judged for, but. Well, I mean, because it's only a couple out of how many, then overall yeah, yeah. you can still pass off the image of like, oh, you know, I'm not related for the lewd stuff. I just, you know, I'm like. You know, you it's know, like a it's documentary really cool. esque. Yeah, 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 yeah. Photo book. It's pretty interesting. Coverage. <laughs> Did you pick it up too? No. Ah. I just assumed just... it is because it's behind the scenes stuff and it's. You know, mm. things you usually don't see, especially in idols. Mm-hmm. A lot of clothes so. on the floor in the photo book. That's what, that's like the biggest thing I noticed. I don't know why. There's like just pictures of like random clothes on the floor. Mm. Yeah. Well. But there's a lot of behind the scenes. And they use all the space. There's no white spaces in this photo book. Ooh. So like they're on the side or sometimes there's like four in one, in one uh-huh. page. Cool. See, I bet you, I bet you they like perused our photo book videos <laughs> before making it and was like, well, that's not a bad idea. Rather than just putting one tiny picture in the middle of this page, we can just fill it up with four pictures. Mm. I feel like Brilliant. it's a lot easier too, since it's more like documentary-esque. Yeah. Have like a lot more photos to choose from. Right. That's cool. You know, something set up. So I guess yeah. if you're into whack idols, go pick that shit up. Oh yeah, dude. As all of them. Mm-hmm. Um, so, we were doing the uh, giveaway for the Ikuta Erika <laughs> photo book on Instagram. That shit is now closed, boys. RNG Jesus rap. will choose. Rap. Well, has chosen. RNG Jesus Ooh, has, chosen has chosen the Ooh. winner, the lucky winner to get the lewds. And of course, if you're it's watching, me. Uh, <laughs> check, your, check your Insta DMs. Mm. We'll slide right on in. Mm -hmm. dude i wanted to i wanted to comment on the picture just to be like supportive of uh, the giveaway but i didn't want people to think that i was entering our own giveaway (laughs) you know like oh what the fuck is swole taku doing commenting (laughs) in this shit dude (laughs) trying to win algorithm (laughs) (laughs) so yes winner you have been dm'd i slid right on in yes so um yeah um what else send us your deeds if you're watching i guess and then send it over can i just uh, say i n- no one takes better photos of photo books than our instagram that's right boys the four mm. photos or whatever how, how yeah, many yeah, are yeah. there has got right. the, the nogisatsu one right it's like you know it's a top down shot but you got some uh some set dressing there with the you see, mm-hmm. like, a little desk plan, a phone, and, a, you know, it's like, okay, it's a nice casual one. Yeah. Dude. You got the coffee cup with keychain and um, Inoue, right? Another top-down one. And then we got these two bulkalicious ones that we just put out of intermission and the idle one. So, mm-hmm. uh, if you guys want that mm-hmm. good, good, make sure you follow us on Instagram. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Slope.club. So, uh, thanks, everybody, who... Uh commented and followed the instagram just mm-hmm. keep let us know out. what content you want to see on there or that stuff <laughs> sorry someone in the chat said may uh seepuku said make a photo book of other photo books Ooh, <laughs> that is th- that is it guys that's uh, that's uh the project here all right that is what we need to do mm, photo book exception dude so meta um, please order our new shashinshu it will be called shashinshu <laughs> <laughs> Like, ooh, it must be like Jimmy posing all lewd. Wait, what? <laughs> the closest photo thing books. Gonna, just the closest the thing books. will be like a, a shot of me holding a photo book. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Just. Yep. Um, yeah, we're gonna work on the Insta more. You mind yeah. if I post a story on the Insta? Once, of which? Yeah, go ahead. Once, okay. once we get more stuff to take pictures of, mm. you know, look out for that. Mm-hmm. Anyway, mm-hmm. yeah. Thank you for everyone. Uh, everyone for and just because you didn't win doesn't mean you should unfollow. Following the inst- yeah, yeah. Come on, man. Come on, Come on dude. What if we do no, another we'll- one? Exactly. Yeah. Maybe Theoretically, 
you know, you'll be already like entered. I don't, I don't know. Yeah, yeah, maybe the next time I buy, I buy a photo book, I accidentally get two. You never yeah. know. Mm-hmm. See? Mm-hmm. So or maybe he accidentally gets five and then he has to give away all of them. What? Yeah. I don't know. Well, uh, anyway. Not my money. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> um, yeah, so. Thank you, everybody. Now it's time for the comment of the week. Ooh. The chosen one of this week. Who's it gonna be? This is from user Chin Tao. Oh. Okay. And the comment says Hinatazaka Independence Day is the same day as Japanese National Foundation Day. Mm. Okay. Look at, Look at that. That coincidence. What is it's not a coincidence. Japanese National Foundation. Foundation Day. Well, I mean the the Hyuga clan is the oldest one of the hidden village or the village hidden in the leaf. Gosh, look at these weebs! Oh, it is celebrating the mythological foundation of Japan. Ooh, there we go. Okay, there you go. Um, eleven oh, wait, February. Wait, wait, what was the name? What was the name of the emperor of the first emperor? <laughs> what was the name? Jimmy. Emperor <laughs> Jimmy. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's a you, dude. It's a you. <laughs> it's Jimmu. J I M M U. I think they meant to spell Y, but it just got cut, the bottom just got cut off. You know, is it like so, so? Now is it Jimmy, James, Jimothy, Jimu? <laughs> the, the emperor. The emperor. <laughs> mm. Yes, the first emperor has arrived. There he is, dude. <laughs> uh, or is Jimu like the super lewd one? <laughs> Oh no, uh, we need we need we need some someone someone dude, with like, a knowledge of Japanese like he is a uh, history. descendant of the sun <laughs> goddess Amaterasu dude. Yeah. He, he launched a military expedition from Hyuga near the <laughs> This is this is <laughs> Oh god damn it dude. Oh the lore is so deep dude. <laughs> Uh, Time to make Jimuzaka 46. <laughs> Jimuzaka. <laughs> so stupid. <laughs> uh, thank you for the comment, user. Thank you very much. Chin Tao. Chin Tao. Mm-hmm. Oh, that, br- that brightened my day. Thank you for that. <laughs> it was the comment that kept on giving. Right? Those are the best yeah. ones. Mm. All right. Huh. Can Rock. we get to some current events? Yes, let's. There's a lot of shit this week to go through, so mm-hmm. yeah, let's uh, hold let's... on to your balls. <laughs> oh, we moving, boys. The shilling corner is back, bitches. It's Oof, time to sell out. Are you guys Pay ready? us. That's right. I see this right here. This is is this is part of, is this one? That is the cause of shilling corner right there. Mm. Lotion. Got, anyway, got some. Got some checks to cash. Let's go. Shiraishi Mai is part of the new SoftBank campaign, the mm-hmm. Giga Kuni thingy. There are some yeah. new commercials. Uh, well, actually, one new main one uh, that follows mm-hmm. up the first two that they released. But, uh, I yeah. still don't understand these. It's it's How a country. You, what, what's difficult? That to has no Wi-Fi, it. man. Yeah. So, you know, Shirashimai is one of four adventurers. They come on, on to this country and there's no Wi-Fi in it, dude. That's terrible. Mm-hmm. It's like future? That's that's what but I'm saying. Like, they got like little stops. robos and stuff like that. But like, you can't have Wi-Fi? This is, this is what happens when like, you have technology advanced, but then like the Wi-Fi doesn't work and then it turns yeah. into this. I'm just, I'm just waiting for like the mid-season, like, uh, like big turnaround where you find out that the real reason they don't have Wi-Fi is because they have it, but they're like keeping it from the people. Oh, oh the government. Only the, only the, yeah, the royals yeah. use the Wi-Fi. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then like Mayan and team have to like they, liberate the Wi-Fi yeah. for Ooh, the people. There we go. Yeah, they uncover, but yeah, Mayan is the mean. Well, she sets everyone straight. 
that she's mm. the one san mm. character. Has the yeah, harisen in this commercial. And mm, give him that slap. They're like in a, in a restaurant and the girl's like, please, I need the Wi-Fi. <laughs> <laughs> I need the Wi-Fi. Uh, the I, like, end, I like the end screen. Yeah, but they're like, click this thing uh-huh. and subscribe. God damn it. Mm. Mm. <laughs> if you guys want to find out the mid-season episode <laughs> where the Wi-Fi is being kept, yes. you guys stay subscribed. You gotta hit that bell button. So Just they, like you should uh, hit the bell button on mm-hmm. Slope Club on YouTube.com. You go ahead and hit the bell button to keep up to date with our videos and podcasts. Yes. Uh, there are also um, new solo, well, not solo, but like new movies, I guess, as part of it for Shiraishi and Tsuchiya Tao's characters. It's particular. Uh, that's cool. It's like Mayan watching cat videos on her phone. <laughs> and the guy's like, uh, Shiraishi san? Uh, and she's like, hey, man, can't you see I'm watching cat videos? <laughs> and she gets mad. Oh, the doe ass, dude. <laughs> the doe ass. Mm. So strong. Mm. I grow so powerful, dude. <laughs> the, god, the god emperor, Jimmy, grows <laughs> stronger even. Mm. Yeah, it's pretty time to Time to found a nation, dude. Mm. Mm-hmm. Are you going to find it as Jimu? <laughs> yeah, dude. But yeah, it's cute. And yeah, she's like making my, video, or uh, not video, she's making faces and shit at the camera. Yeah. TikTok. It's cool. You can watch the whole thing on the SoftBank website or YouTube. Mm-hmm. Um, it's a series of <laughs> Mayan emotions. Mm. Uh, there's one where she's like all sad. And there's one where she's like, I'm watching dramas. Don't bother me. Mm. I'm sorry. God Empress Mayan. <laughs> um, yeah, so... Even the God Emperor bows down to the goddess, <laughs> dude. <laughs> so if you're in Japan, switch to SoftBank and support Shiraishi Mai. Mm. If you're in the States, switch to Sprint. Yeah, because SoftBank owns Sprint now, right? Or oh, whatever. Yeah. Really? Something like that. I actually used to be on Sprint. I am no longer. I am not I've, on Sprint. I've never had that service. Oh. Mm-hmm. So. It was awful when I was in LA because like, okay, when I was in San Diego, it was fine. But then the area I I had, I lived in, in LA, was like a dead spot for Sprint. <laughs> so when I moved, I'm like, oh, I guess I don't have any service at home. <laughs> that's fine. The worst. Yeah. But anyways. But yeah, that's the SoftBank commercial. Let's mm-hmm. keep it moving with more commercials. Kiaki Zaka is in a new Fortune Music commercial. Um, mm-hmm. it's in also, there's also a uh, Hinata Zaka, right? And then we've all seen the Nogi Zaka one where they're like at the handshake event or whatever. Mm-hmm. Um, but uh, yeah, it's, it's like them talking to the camera, saying stuff. Mm-hmm. I don't know. Yeah. I can't hear what they're saying. <laughs> so we got Risa. Jimmy, what are they saying? We have it's Uemu, like, Koike, and mm-hmm. just being like thankful for things, you know? Mm-hmm. Yeah, we have Risa, Rika. Koike, Rika. It's pawns there. Uemu. I'm Pons. thankful for this Sugai. music service. Mm. Mm. Oh, this is for the handshake, right? Mm. Yeah, music? that's yeah. what you have to buy through uh, to get Sakamichi handshakes. Or Actually, no, because I bought it. Hey, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Then why'd you ask me, man? What, what? Jesus. That subtle flex, dude. <laughs> that's where I got my handshake to get you. All right, that's done. I'm the only one in this group who's handshaked 46, huh? I'm going to move on. Uh, there's a new commercial for Haruyama, the suit Ooh, let's go. company that Nogizaka um, are the image of characters. Give me more world. power suits. So this time they're promoting, oh, they've been promoting ladies' suits. Oh no, that vertical video, dudes. Mm -hmm. No, this is on purpose. (sighs) Supposed to be like this. But yeah, it's like uh, them walking. Mm -hmm. Shiraishi Umizawa. Is that way? Saito Asuka Uh, and Hori Mjolner's. Long hair Hori, though. Walking forward. So yeah, they got their shilling new suits, man. Mm -hmm. We have like, you know, a uh, (laughs) two-button suit. You got a, a skirt. There's also pants. Mm-hmm. Uh, 24,000 yen. All right, guys. Would you rock the ruffle blouse? 
No. Mm. You don't want to you don't look like Prince? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ain't no one got swag like He's Prince, dude. That's what? true, dude. <laughs> You're right. Ow! Uh, it's like, ooh, look at look at that swagger, dude. So it's such confidence. I'm mm. more of a uh, meat tie guy, so... Mm. None, like none the of classic those, look, None right? of those ruffles on my, mm. my chest, dude. You just need to get the ruffles and, like, a brooch. <laughs> Way to be extra, man. <laughs> He's got his hair, you know, just all this kind of flowing. Oh, cleanse yourselves in the waters of Lake Minnetonka. <laughs> um, but yeah, if you're interested, uh, I don't know why we would be buying women's suits, but hey, there's a 20,000 yen one. Oh, all right. A, a cheaper alternative. Mm-hmm. Okay, this is weird. Okay, so the the twenty thousand dollar or not dollar yen one is a, yeah, is no. a double two two button suit. The rest Ooh. are just one button. I don't know why we're talking about this so deeply. But, <laughs> this uh, is important. We gotta learn about women's fashion. Yeah, where's where's the men's uh, stuff? There's something there's something about the lines on a a single button suit. It just I don't know. It looks weird to me. Yeah, I mean, it's the same thing as a two button, but without this, because yeah, you, ne- but- you never button the bottom one. Like exactly, my end, like, not- look, look at that shit. She knows, she knows, dude. No, but that's a what woman's suit. Story. What are you? Yeah, it's different for, for it's a women for completely sure. Completely different yeah. cut, but or men's suits. Mm-hmm. Heed these words: you never button the bottom one. Yeah, dude. But I don't know. There's something about that like little slot for where a button should be. Not being there. Oh yeah, I, I see it, what you mean. It just weirds me out, you know. Mm. And then if you scroll down, you get Tina Tamashiro. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Tina, mm. Tina Pouty, dude. Let's go. Tina's good. I like Anyways. Tina. Anyway, uh, yeah. If you want suits, go buy it from Hariyama because Nogizaka is supporting it. <laughs> For sure, with the skirt, dude. <laughs> I gotta support. <laughs> next, uh, like my I'm next straight. fucking job interview will be in a, a Haruyama suit, dude. <laughs> also, you show up with the skirt. It's not that expensive. I mean, I'm. It's probably not like the best. It's like department store pieces, prices. Yeah, right? department yeah. store price. So, yeah. you know, for the working people, mm-hmm. good shit. Let's move on. More commercials, man. Jeez, <laughs> even more. Uh, well, which which one's next? Oh, uh, so Nogizaka has been uh, promoting the Sapporo Ichiban ramen, the Ajira. Mm. You know, uh, mm-hmm. I think Josh bought some when he went to Japan. No, I got the cup star. That's the same shit. Is or it same oh. company or whatever? Somewhere over there. Sapporo Ichiban. Anyway, mm. um, there there's a new th- campaign thingy that they're working on with Matsumura Sayuri. It's mm-hmm. like, oh, which of these should we put out? Sorry, what do you think? Yeah. And so this is, is this is like the fifth episode in a series they've been doing. Um, uh, the first, well, the first episode was like an int- introduction type thing where they follow her around. And mm-hmm. then the next three were her were like actually going to the like cities or whatever that the new flavors are based on and tasting mm. them. And then the new one that we're checking out is the only one that matters because it has Shirai Shimai. <sighs> oh, right? Do you notice all these commercials? <laughs> yeah. I'll have Shirai Shimai. Clutch and checks, dude. Yeah, so, you know, she's like eating the, the, the ramen. She's like, ooh, this is good. Oh, this is also good. Like, oh, I cannot decide which one. So let me get some help. So mm-hmm. she goes talk to my shiraish. <laughs> like, oh, let me give you this ramen and you will taste it and see if we can decide on which one to release. But then in the end, Mayan's like, man, I can't decide either. <laughs> uh, uh, uh. We watched. <laughs> to get to go buy them all. <laughs> six minutes of content without an answer. <laughs> mm. the best kind of content dude 
But if you look at our videos on Slope Club, you get to see answers oh on there. And if you subscribe, you can keep up to date with it. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, so if you want to watch the whole thing, it's on the Sapporo Ichiban website. It, it's worth a skim just for like the facial expressions they make. They're like, mm-hmm. Yeah. You no, know, tasting the ramen. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I don't know. I'm a, I'm a sucker for idols eating. So. Oh, yeah. Why isn't your Oshi Matsumura Sayuri then? Oh, that's true. That's a good point. But, you know, she talks. I know she's capable of eating a lot, but they don't show it a lot. You know what I mean? Mm. This is true. They only show it like a couple but, times. Yeah, right? you only see it a couple times. I feel yeah. like Recently, since, she's, since she's debuted, Mukai has had more eating mm. than, ah, yes. than. Yeah. And, this, you know, it's my little sister. I can't know she her. It's weird. This is true. <laughs> but, um, yeah, uh, go go eat Sapporo Ichiban ramen. Because mm. Nogizaka does three new too. Flavors. See, that's the biggest lie of this video is that, like, you can still maintain looks like Shiraishi Mai from <laughs> eating fucking cup ramen, dude. You know, she probably eats mm. that shit, like, she probably eats like, like, I haven't to the eaten this since before that. I joined the group. <laughs> She's probably though probably the only time she ever eats cup ramen is like when she shoots commercials for cup ramen. Mm. Yeah, she like fake chews it. Mm. <laughs> oh, she! <laughs> it's got the little wine, like <laughs> the wine tasting bucket. It's like, yeah. Yeah. oh, she! Oh, she. <laughs> yeah. They just they just know when to cut it. Where's the bucket? Spit it out immediately. But uh, <coughs> yeah, I, I'd, I'd like to try. Maybe they right, actually right. have those at like Japanese supermarkets. Just, yeah, yeah, probably. Yeah. Mm. Um. Anyway, let's keep going. Um. There's there's a, one more one new more. Nogizaka commercial. G- guess I, I guess if Shirashi is in this one. What do you guys think? Is yes. she? Is she? Yes. Yes. That would be right. That Ooh. is correct. Shirashi Mai is also in this commercial, and it's the bank one where they sing in English. This is a new mm. one, a new iteration. Oh, well, I'm gonna turn this shit up. I'm not listening to you guys at all. <laughs> um, and they, you know, it's it's all pastels with like uh, light blues and pinks and stuff. But the best part of this commercial is Mayan wearing high waisted pants. I mean, ashes too, but yeah, you know, and Mayan. a two. Um, but you know, I like Mayan more. So mm. <laughs> anyway, it's it's the the. G- Awa Ginko or whatever uh, this mm-hmm. particular series of commercials is about like, a, a card loan is that like a credit card I don't know what that probably um, it's gonna be so many dudes taking out loans now <laughs> <laughs> loans for the handshakes right dude I'd get a new credit card <laughs> if it had Mayan's face on it mm. oh I'd get one every uh, time you pay it's just Mayan's face dude yeah <laughs> It's, I just, that just reminds me of like, I mean, the credit card thing where like um, this person tried to get Terry Crews on their on their mm. credit card, and then they got a message back saying like, "Oh, we, we need permission from Terry Crews or whatever." <laughs> and so they like they put it on Twitter like at Terry Crews, like, "Yo, this is cool." <laughs> and then he's like, he replies like, "Yeah, dude." <laughs> <laughs> like, oh, word. That's right. I just need a at mention my end on Twitter. <laughs> But she doesn't have one, at least officially. Yeah, but um, mm-hmm. yeah, this is a follow. This new commercial is a follow up. The first mm-hmm. one was like they were wearing like yellow and stuff. Mm-hmm. Still singing in English. Song? Same song or a different song? I don't remember. I can't uh, hear yeah, it yeah. right now, but I kind of nah, nah 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 nah. I don't know, dude. See, I I I have to like ask myself: Are these commercials effective at all? Because I don't care anything about bank loans watching this, but all I can think of is like, mm, look at these Nogizaka members. <laughs> That's yeah, it's supposed to, I don't know, low key but, get you to. Yeah, it's more about them. like brand recognition, right? Yeah. And then mm-hmm. like, uh, like, you know, when you see the, the bank, you're like, oh, okay, well, this must be a reputable bank because I remember, uh, you know, they got this big idol group on there, so they have to mm. be big, you know? Mm. Yes. So it's more about the, the brand prestige. There we go. Yeah, you, that, you relate to that is. brand a little bit more than you do with mm. the other ones because you mm. relate to them because of the commercial. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So if you do need a loan, 
you'd be like, oh, you know, I'm going to go here. It's not supposed to convince you to get one. Yeah, like if you want to get a loan, be like, I want to support the Slope Club. So then like, you get Oh loan. my, that's enough. <laughs> mute him, mute him. I'm about to end the show. <laughs> anyway, that's it for the shilling corner. Hey. Uh, it was back in full force. So mm. many commercials. Mm-hmm. We got to cash checks like Shirashi Mai, dude. Yeah, so, you know, you can get a loan. Maybe you can eat some ramen. Ooh. Buy some lady mm. suits for yourself. Mm-hmm. Literally, the only commercial we went through today that she wasn't in was the Kiyaki Zaka one, dude. Yeah. <laughs> it's only because there she's not in that group. Mm. Yeah, mm-hmm. dude. If not, you she know, if she in was in Kiyaki Zaka, yeah. <laughs> she'd be like the first one. Like, yeah. oh. <laughs> right. So there you go. Mm-hmm. That ends right. the shilling corner. It's time for some current events. Who? Mm. What's going on in the world of Sakamichi series? Well, friends. <laughs> Hinata Zaka. Oh, jinx. Oh. I owe you a soda. Mm. Um, as you know, they are what used to be Hiragana Keiaki Zaka. Now they are their mm. own group, seceded from Keiaki Zaka. Yes. It was announced recently that four of them will be exclusive mm. models to four different magazines. My mm-hmm. God. So, so quick, dude. Right? Yeah. The group like, just formed last know, week. That. Wow, that's yeah, dude. What meteoric rise even mm. faster than Keaki Zaka? Mm-hmm. My word. Mm-hmm. But anyway, we have Kato Shiho. She's gonna be signed to Can Cam. Mm-hmm. And uh Sasaki Kumi will be signed to Ray. Should I she's out and she's like, excuse me? Yep, yep. <laughs> and comes right in. Uh Sasaki Wait, did they say Mire? Sorry, Kumi. Kumi is on Kumi, Ray. yeah. Mire yeah, Kumi, is on Nonno mm. with uh, Risa and Nishino Nanase. Right? Mm-hmm. And then Takamoto Ayaka is on JJ with Habu. Mm-hmm. So, uh, who's in Can Can? Uh, Mizuk Yamashita. Right? Oh. Um, so, they have more models. With exclusive uh, contracts than Kiyaki Zaka. Mm, yeah. Already. So, including Kosaka now from last July, right? She signed to oh, 17. Yeah. Yeah. That mm-hmm. makes, uh, what is it, five? Five Total? from Hinata. So. And Kiyaki has? Kiyaki has four. Four, there we go. By one. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah. That's cool. Uh, mm-hmm. A few of these girls have already been modeling, um, like runway shows, like Tokyo Girls Collection and stuff. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Um, which, by the way, they will be on. Oh, oh look the at that! Spring and summer Oof. show mm-hmm. of TGC. Mm-hmm. So, if you want to see people showing off clothes. You can go ahead and do that. But if you want to see more stuff about clothes, you can see this new concept movie that Techi is in for the clothing brand. Damn, and dude, Josh Mirage. ran the gun right there. I was, <laughs> I wasn't done with this shit. Oh my what bad, the fuck, Josh. <laughs> I was, I was like, I found the segue. Let me go. <laughs> I was, I was like, oh, okay, I'll, uh, you know, talk more about Tokyo Girls Click. Nope, never mind. <laughs> Josh wants to move on, so we will do so. Uh, yeah. I was going to mention Tina. Okay, <laughs> we're going back because Josh <laughs> trying to run away. Uh, it was a good segue, though. It's a good yeah, segue. it was. But, uh, you know, the usual suspects will be on Tokyo Girls Collection from, you know, Kiaki Nogi and Hinata. Right? Mayan, uh, Ash, Rika, and Risa. You know, all these people. Hori, Maichun, Mizawa, Mizuki. Yeah. From Kiaki, yeah. Habun, Pon. These are the the four, right? Rika and mm-hmm. Risa, Habu, Kobayashi. Mm-hmm. They're the ones who were signed as exclusive models from Kiyaki. Uh, of course, Imaizumi left. So, one less than Hinata. Mm. Um, but yeah, you know, we also have Kiritani Mirei. And Aoki, Aoki Araki Yuko. And then and Tina, Jimmy's favorite. <laughs> Ooh, let's go. <laughs> Tina Pouty. <laughs> I'm a Shira. Mm. And uh, my girl Maggie, dude. 
Oh, Magi. Yeah, that's right. Mm. Uh, Dude, it's weird. I used to only watch these things just to see idols. And now I'm like, where are these other models at, though? <laughs> Yeah, because the models are so good, dude. You just need to go yeah, to their yeah. Instagram and be like, mm, yes. <laughs> <laughs> so, now segue, Josh. Bring it home. Um, they look so good on Instagram, and Techie looked good in this concept movie for the clothing brand <laughs> and Real Lodge. Mm, is that how you say it? Say it? I have no idea. <laughs> great, great. Uh, yeah. And so. Real Age. And, real age and yeah, real got, age yeah and they got a, a little concept movie for uh the brand featuring young high rate urina herself mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. uh-huh so uh yeah it's like for their new collection or whatever mm. and it's supposedly playing with like blacks and transparency or whatever the article mm. said that's why there's all these like clear looking rocks on her shirt uh, it's a very like you know avant-garde style yeah like something you'd see like in a on a like a high fashion runway not so much like yeah like none of this ready, ready to, to wear, wear. Yeah. Yeah, yeah yeah so it won't be at tokyo girls collection <laughs> probably mm-hmm. but uh yeah, what do you guys think of the visuals i mean it, i don't know i feel like techie just has like such a good look in general that anything you slap on her is going to look really cool. Mm. Yeah. Right. So, I mean, like, so not to knock this stuff, like, I, I think some of it looks really cool. It looks very artistic. Um, at like a minute and 13, I really like the shot of like, uh, Techie. It's like, she's just in blackness and you mm-hmm. see her face. And then she, she's got like the white jemmy prism stuff all over her face and stuff like that. Mm-hmm. I don't know. It feels like something like out of like, a fantasy movie, you know, yeah, so yeah. it looks pretty dope. Yeah, it looks cool. Mm-hmm. If you check their website, you can. I like how you can pause the video and then, like, anything looks like a photo. Oh, yes. That's yeah. true. Very well shot. Uh, mm-hmm. Yep. Um, so, yeah, they this brand is the same brand that designed their ambivalent outfits. Oh. Um, when they performed a music station, when Suzumon was the center, mm. uh, they they designed like the like the, the lights, the and stuff. lights and stuff, or whatever glow in the dark thingy. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, that's on the the back of their outfits. So mm. it's not the first time they're working together. Well, at least with Techi, it was Techi or, Kiyakizaka. I mean, same thing, right? Same thing. It's you Oof. know Yurina and her friends. Mm-hmm. <sighs> Yeah, you can probably buy this stuff if you go to the website. I mean, not the ambivalent thing, but their their clothes. You want the translucent grapes? Yeah. It's like they have like uh, sweats and stuff, or sweaters, I don't know. backpacks, some shoes there. Yeah, I For like some how... more streetwear. Yeah, the ready to wear stuff is super street wear, and then like this video is like super high fashion, uh-huh. <laughs> like uh, concept work more than anything, right? Mm-hmm. It's like, oh, what? Ha- you telling me I can't buy all these gems for my face? <laughs> what the hell is this? <clears throat> um, yeah, so I I didn't come here for the the young Techie T. Right, <laughs> which you can buy on Red Bubble. <laughs> uh, my God. Um, anyways, Jimmy, do you still have that? <laughs> what the red? Wait, what? The young touch. I I gave it away in the giveaway. Oh yeah, yeah. Dude. I remember. Yeah, I remember. Yeah. Um, Wait, boy, do you have it or? I have a shirt. I got a shirt. Mm. Oh, yeah. Um, but. Also, Techi's been nominated for Best Newcomer for the Japan Academy Awards, of course, for her performance in Hibiki. Mm. And so all the nominees for that award, uh, they got the like a poster thingy. New Cinema Face 2019. Yeah. Mm. And so like it's, it's like in Shibuya or whatever. Mm. Mm-hmm. She cool. looks so regal, dude. 
Mm-hmm. They got a lot of Mono- newcomers. Yeah, dude. Just all monochrome and stuff like that. Like, oh. Yeah. Looks cool, man. That's yeah. a that's a cool series of uh, shots that they got. They look like JoJo characters turned real life. <laughs> right? Yeah. <laughs> What's Techi Stan? I don't know. Silent Majority. Yeah. That, that's, it would have to be that, right? Yeah. yeah. It'd be like not just the one stand, but like a lot of. What's the. Yeah, dude. <laughs> it's like the. What was that guy in part four that had a bunch of. Oh, little the feet? little toy soldiers? Yeah. Toy soldiers? Yeah, yeah, dude. Or the other guy who like controls these little things to get shit for oh, him. Or is it? Um, fuck, what's his name? The little fat guy, dude. Yeah, that guy. <laughs> With the spiky hair. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It looks like spiky skin. Yeah, yeah. Fuck, what was his name? Oh, is that Sutaya? Hmm? I know where this is. That building is like on oh, the, the side uh, of that building. It's like posters? super. It's like it has like a screeching noise to it. <laughs> I think it's to keep birds away. Mysterious screeching noise. I think it's to keep birds away, like birds and little kids, because it's oh, annoying. There's like things where birds can make their nests and whatnot. It's like noises, so like they stay away. I think. Ah, uh, okay. But yeah, they were they were uh, talking about on girls' locks because it's the third week of the month, and that means <sighs> resurrection. Yurina returns from her slumber. Mm. Um, her hair is all like fizzy and shit, frizzy. Because she dyed it blonde for the sake I know. <laughs> My hair's mm. fucked up because I dyed it blonde. <laughs> uh, Someone please help my hair. Uh, but yeah, in the girl's locks, she like talked about Kuroi Hitsuji and Stargazer. Mm. So if you're interested, you can go read this stuff. Dude, I just want girl's lock Techi to show up for any Kayaki Zaka thing, dude. Just once. No, that's, that's never going to happen. Just, just once. It's not meant Let's to be, back. Jimmy. This, is the, this is the time. only time you get, you know. She Hirate always looks so... A normal Hirate Yurina, dude. She always looks so cute and happy in, in girls' lock photos, dude. dude. That's why all the Techioshis look forward to the third week of the month. <laughs> <laughs> when she returns... Real, the real Rejoice. Techi re- returns. Mm-hmm. And then after that, it's off to being another character. Oh, no. <laughs> like fades away in the darkness. <laughs> I'll be back next month. <laughs> anyway, let's keep going. Mm-hmm. Kobayashi Yui's photo book has a title now and some covers. Ooh. It's called Kanojo no kozu i don't know what that means which which means uh what is it composition of uh what is it emotions and feelings it's kanjo oh kanjo my bad uh-huh. i said kanjo, kanjo. Yeah. yeah i was like i was like I composition kanjo no kanjo kozu. no kozu there we go um yeah we got uh four no three different covers right three from amazon and two others <laughs> lawson and hmv and hmv mm-hmm. so um i don't know which is lawson which. and the hmv are together so there's one where she's it's like a closer a tighter shot where we're like leaning on her or arm mm. and then there's one where she's wearing the blue the blue what is it? Like a suit jacket and a the bikini or a lingerie. I don't know. I the don't know blue one's about. dangerous, dude. Yeah, this I one. Uh, I like it though. No, it's which, a really uh, yeah. Like overall, which was the Amazon one? That's what we're gonna get because we. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> well, which was the Amazon from... one? And then the Does last one is her like crashing down. She's wearing white in front mm. of like a. Why do I have ordered the regular edition when I should have the Amazon edition? Uh, so the one that's order. linked on Amazon Chum. is the the tight one. Yeah, that's right. not that's the regular edition. Oh, oh. there's a different edition. I and see. the blue one is the Amazon edition. Ooh, which is a different right. link. Uh, so okay. I'm canceling the order on the other one, getting that so blue one. You want to get this one, you lewd boys? Because mm-hmm. um, you know there's a lot of skin going on. Mm. I a, know, I know that's, that's a, all you want from porn. That's a porn. 
I never thought I needed. Oh, you know what God. I mean? When, it, when like I, all Kiaki members release a photo book, it's... I didn't think I needed this Kiaki member, like, <laughs> you know? <laughs> Dude, I remember there was a point in my life when I was like, never, never give me... Must protect. Now we're just like, give me the ludes. Mm-hmm. All right, I have ordered the correct version. Uh, Dude, it's just like, it's like the expression, too, that gets me for that mm-hmm, one. Mm-hmm. You know, it's like, okay, mm-hmm. like, pawn leg and cleavage, I get it. That That's going to that's gonna be attractive. Like, but that's, like, attractive on anyone, right? You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. But, like, the fact that she's, like, looking right at the camera with the, the steely gaze, and then, like, the tones are all blue. Yeah, for me, it was expression, like, most mm-hmm. of it. Yeah, I like, uh... The, and the, the colors? Colder. It's all, yeah, it's all colder. Photos like in monochrome. general. Mm. That lean towards the blue. So I like this one the most. Not because I'm lewd, but because mm. I'm lewd. <laughs> anyway, yeah, yeah, you want to get that version, guys? Good thing it's on Amazon, uh, where I always get my photo books. Mm-hmm. So. But we're not done yet. We got some more previews coming out of Keiaki Zaka 46. Oh. oh, my God. What? Did I segue too early? No. Oh, That's perfect. Yeah. I had nothing else to say about Pon's photo book. Right. So, um, we got some uh, previews for or from Kuroi Hitsuji. Some of the B-sides got music videos uh, mm-hmm. over the past mm-hmm. week since mm-hmm. we last discussed it. So, of course, there's the main B-side. Uh, nobody. Nobody, nobody, nobody. Mm. Uh, watch watch it. So it. Josh no, I hasn't watched it. watched it, so I guess I'll talk about it. Okay, I'll watch I it. Have. Jimmy has also, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I watched it like the second it came out. Okay, I love this music video, <laughs> dude. It's so good. Too. I, I really, <laughs> I really, really like this video. Mostly dude. because of the dance shot. Like, all right, the mm. other ones where they're like in, in, you know, they're just sitting or whatever doing whatever it's it's fine mm-hmm. they look nice they look cute but like the dance shot nah. wins it for me dude dude this is okay like i know people are like of course keiaki zaka's in suits and stuff but this is the most feminine keiaki zaka we have seen yeah. to date you know um, like the movements the choreography is all very not just like cutesy but it's like a very mature feminine which is like yeah dude they, they you know completely new for this group there's some you like know? you know hip swaying and gyrations going on it's yeah, kind of like you know they kind of went for a more like mature sexy vibe but not mm-hmm. like overly so right it's it's like their yeah, way yeah yeah. Uh, yeah yeah exactly you know they're like completely covered up they're wearing like turtlenecks and jackets you mm-hmm. know but like ooh, once you get to the 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 chorus and it gets like mm, mm, mm. i'm like ooh, yeah ooh, it's yeah. great dude um <laughs> Yeah, the 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 colors work yeah. very well. It's very bright. Right. It's like the brightest Kiaki mm-hmm. or most vibrant rather Kiaki video I think <laughs> they've ever made. Uh, so many colors, but the the main dance shot is my favorite. Um, See, if if Kuroi Hitsuji the song wasn't so impactful, I I, I would have wished that this was the A side. Mm. I I feel like. As much as I like the nobody like the song, I feel Kuro Hitsuji's song was like it leaves a stronger impression for sure. Like uh, if you were okay. just to listen listen to it without the videos. Oh uh, right, right? right, right. Yeah, yeah. But yeah. like But man, nobody is fucking cool, dude. Yeah. I, I am I actually like nobody more. Mm-hmm. I don't know. Kuro Hitsuji is a little too deep. Uh, mm. this one, like the hook is catchy to me, where they're like nobody, nobody. Nobody nobody. Yeah. Yeah, and then you got like the little kind of like horns playing counter to that too, you yeah, know? Yeah, it's like dude, 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 dude. Yeah, dude. Mm. Um, but yeah, the I, I really like their suits with the mm-hmm. the navy turtlenecks. Yeah. Um, I just wish the tailoring on Tetchi's pants was a little bit more fit. All right? Uh, I see what like, you're I don't know. Like maybe maybe it's just my aesthetic. I just feel that she especially with the shoes, she gets a little blocky at the bottom. Mm. And I guess a really minor complaint, but because she is kind of the center, it sticks out to me a little bit. I think uh, I don't know. I think I'm fine with it. Um, mm. 
If it was a little tighter, it would like take the shape of her legs. Um, oh, and like, it will go like too the, sexy. Yeah, but I think the point of the like that look, right? It's, it's supposed to be like a straight line. That's why there's like the the crease down the middle mm, on the pants. True. So um, yeah, I like how it's uh the pants are cropped higher. Um, yeah, yeah. Like yeah. when they had suits for Kazunif Karatemo, it was eh, you know barely touching the shoe, but this is like. Crop, cropped yeah. up higher it gives it like a, a more retro look i think especially mm. with the colors but yeah yeah i also I like menswear and suiting so you might not care about that kind of stuff guys but i do mm. and i like it what about how do you feel about the shoes the shoes are fine i think i, mm. I don't know it's, it looks like the same shoes they were for freaking kazenif mm. karatemo uh, I, that's what i'm saying i have like mixed feelings like okay i don't hate it I, sure. I like the chunky sole though. Mm-hmm. That's what, yeah. I like. I'm curious what it would look like with a not chunky sole, mm. but I, I wouldn't. I, I don't necessarily like dislike it. I'm just, you know, like it's one of the things. Like I would, I'd like to see it just to compare, see which one I like more. But. Yeah, yeah. Um, okay, I'm back. Okay, I Josh. The music video. Um, but yeah, I like. I like the. See, see now that we have the music video, if it's like very feels very retro, right? Uh, mm-hmm. the song and the video together yeah yeah so i'm gonna go out and find a orange double-breasted suit Ooh. <laughs> hit me with the turtleneck my guy and then uh i'll just find a navy turtleneck and we are good to go the only thing we can't have is the big uh frilly uh the, like the sleeve thingy yeah yeah. but that's cool because it you know i don't know to me it looks it makes it more feminine looking mm-hmm. so yeah anyway mr box you're rejoining us oh man i found mm-hmm. on an aliexpress it's not exactly the same but <laughs> this must be like made of cheap polyester oh my god post it in the twitch chat so i can oh no you got it look at this shit dude Look at our boy. I don't know what that is, but he's no. It's orange and it's double breasted. That's, uh, that's all that's we what's need. His name? Hell yeah, dude! Isn't that Will I Am? No, that what? is not Will I Am, no, Josh. Is <laughs> that is not. That ain't him, dude. No, <laughs> William. <laughs> that ain't William, dude. <laughs> anyway, Josh, what you think? <laughs> Fuck, dude. <laughs> 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 okay. <laughs> Sorry, I'm I'm back. Okay. Um, I thought it was pretty groovy. Um, I like the rhythm it has going on. Um, wardrobe was interesting. How they like kept it all like up tight and like covered. Um, had a different dancing than what they usually do. Um, I think Tetchy's pants were a little bit big at the bottom um she had the same like, problem like, like with straight mm. um and with the shoes i feel like it could have been changed a little um i guess i'm yeah, the only one that good. likes it <laughs> i i think i i just always <laughs> am going to gear like what is it have a bias towards a slimmer fit for the mm. bottoms yeah um but uh I mean, this, it, the thing is, I think now it's mostly moving towards a looser fit. Mm-hmm. Mm. Well, I think especially yeah. with like the the how chunky the shoes are, you know, I it, it might have it might be too clowny looking with like a, a slim fit. Yeah, mm. that's you know yeah. what I mean. So the looser fit know, makes I, it more balanced. Yeah, exactly. I it's more of like like kind of how I feel about the shoes. I'd like to see it. You know, in an ideal world where I control everything, I'd like to see a like a, 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 s- a like slimmer more. variation, right? Yeah, like a slimmer variation with a not as chunky sole. I would be curious to see how that looks in compa- in contrast. Mm. Someone use the but liquify I, tool in Photoshop, but I'm not gonna say it's better because mm. I don't know. But I yeah. would like to see it. You know, yeah. yeah. So but that's um, just me and my 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 like very not like. My very basic sensibilities when it comes to suits. Mm. Uh, yeah, so that was nobody, nobody, nobody. 
I like how the the background when they were dancing it looks like a James Bond intro, mm. like from a movie. Yeah, dude, that psychedelic and like, shit. I mean, I, I know you, they don't really do or add anything, but even the other little solo shots and things like that just yeah. look nice. <laughs> I like how yeah, we yeah, didn't yeah. even we didn't even touch that. <laughs> I'm like, oh yeah, the solo shot of Mao Oshiman is the greatest. No, <laughs> we're just like them suits though. The suits. Mm. I, mean, I can oh, always just look at the, the camera. The soles and the tapering on the <laughs> pants. <laughs> Our focus is completely different here, obviously. Um, but that was Habu, Habu was really yeah, great. Yeah, pretty good. Yeah. Yeah, she, yeah. She was wearing the green, right? Is that what? Um, is that it's Habu? like a blue. Yeah, yeah. It's like a bunch of colored balls, and she's. Like blue background and stuff. Gabadi. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh, okay. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. The colors were really cool here. Yeah. You know. I like. I like. I, th- I think that. I think that's like the main thing. The uh, other little like shots, pr- like outside the dance, like shots provided was just uh, some more splashes of color throughout the video. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Did you pause on the Risa one? <laughs> no. <laughs> anyway. Uh, yeah, that was that was nobody. Um, but we got more. Yeah, we also yeah we also have the Yukonen mm, video. Mm, I haven't seen this yet. So. Hiru no Takasa. So Josh hasn't seen it, and uh, I'll, I'll see you guys soon. <laughs> Gonna meet he, you guys again. While he go checks that out, uh, Jimmy, what'd you think? Oh, whoops, my bad. So, okay. What'd you think? Jimmy? So, so this was, uh, I'm not going to lie. I had hopes for like, all right, if the song itself was going to be gay, <laughs> maybe this, maybe this music video will be. We still want the, the, the homo shit, dude. Yeah, dude. Uh, and it's like very ambiguous, you know, like, I mean, they could just be very close friends, but I'm like, no, dude, this is intimate well apparently i don't know i was what i've seen on twitter it's taking a it's an interpretation on something like a book oh well i'm not well read so i don't know <laughs> yeah you, you know how kiaki fans are there yeah, yeah they'll find like the the inspiration and the meaning Ooh. and what galaxy railway thank you chat this is what Ooh. it's supposed to galaxy is that what it's called Galaxy. She didn't eat the apple. Hey, what? Like, um. So, like, they're they're like, yeah, you know, there's there's parts in the music video where uh, um, it cuts to like words or a sentence or a phrase mm. because apparently that uh, it's, it's lifted from the book. Oh, word. Whatever. So I haven't seen it or watched or uh, I mean, Galaxy Rail. Yeah, read. There's a, I just googled it and there's like a manga or an anime. I don't know. Yeah, but um, see if if they want me to catch a reference, they need to do like, I don't know, a music video based on like Mark Ripito's starting strength or something. <laughs> then I'll be like, oh, I've read that book. <laughs> so when they make an lifting, <laughs> when they made that reference to hip drive, oh, it's I felt okay. It. It's okay, I can. You can deadlift. 100 Ooh. kilos. Let's go. Well, look, at, look at that. Like, perfectly balanced biomechanics, dude. Mm. <laughs> I like the shots of her swimming, though. Like, underwater? Yeah. I, okay, like, stupidity aside, it's like a really pretty... Like, it's really aesthetic, the video, right? Yeah, it I looks mean, like uh, It looks like the shots are, like, straight out of, like, a drama. Your, uh, your actors are pretty aesthetic, too. So Ooh, that, that is true. Mm-hmm. Um, I like. I kind of like how the video is doing this like vertical, vertical thing sideways, and making Josh look stupid on stream. Look at him. <laughs> look at him. Look at him go. Look at him go. Look at this guy. <laughs> uh, but I kind of like he's that. So he's so confused. Where it's like, oh yeah, we shot vertical video, but we turned it to the. Mm. I also like the turkey leg part. Shout out Sato oh, Turkey Amina. leg is the. B- <laughs> God I'm saying? damn it! Classic meme, dude. Shout out um, to Sato Amina Turkey Leg. Right there. Yeah, dude. It's just them laying down eating turkey legs together and shit, dude. Yeah. 
Actually, I need to go back. I'm like, were they laying down or is that just a vertical video part? No, yeah, they're laying down. All right. It's like on the wall. They set up all the chairs yeah. and the tables there. Um, but uh, yeah, the song's not bad. You know, electro pop. Yeah, yeah. Um, they sound okay. Yeah, we t- we talked about it last week, right? Where we when we yeah. checked out the uh, radio preview. Mm. It doesn't sound not- too much different, to be honest. Um, I don't know. What'd you? Yeah. I, I thought though I thought the video was gonna have more like I don't know growing up themes and stuff like that, considering the, like the lyrics and stuff. Mm. But I mean, it just it just seems to be its own kind of standalone thing, and it's pretty looking. So yeah, I'm yeah. not gonna complain there. It's uh, I mean, it's kind of dark. <laughs> the majority of the video is like at night, right, or like inside. Yeah, yeah. like out, but but like even then, the the dark stuff isn't like. I don't know. It's it's kind of like more for like the drama feel, right? Than like yeah, yeah. Than like emo because it's like them sitting on a boat together, looking off into the distance. You mm. know, where is our life going to take us, Akanen? I don't know, Yuka, but I hope wherever it is, it's with you. Oh, and then gay? they hold hands. Yeah, gay. <laughs> <laughs> Seems like um, it. The story or something is from Akanen's perspective. Mm-hmm. I don't know, cause like at the end she like she like wakes up. I had a dream about me and Yuka, dude. Oof. But when I woke it up, just it was a cat. cat. <laughs> what the hell? All right, I'm back. My neck hurts. All right, Josh, you weren't supposed to like turn your head so much watching this video. I mean, if it's on the side, I'm gonna turn my head to see it straight. But then they it was intended to be watched that way. <laughs> Mr. Box. Josh will do well, I mean, his own thing. What did you think, man? I live my life. <laughs> Don't tell um, me how to live my life. <laughs> <laughs> what did you think, Josh? Um, I'm probably going to need some um, icy hot. So <laughs> tomorrow morning I wake up sore. Um, Just broke his neck, dude. <laughs> uh, it was interesting. Uh, this was, I don't know if you guys talked about it, but I think it was based on a book or something. Like a different story. Yes, we, story we mentioned it, but I like I don't know anything about the book. Oh well, actually, <coughs> oh, okay. I don't know anything about the book either. Um, oh, what a disappointment! <laughs> I was ready to get educated. <laughs> um, yeah, I thought it was good. Um, okay. So many shots look cool. Um, all the shots look nice. Uh, looks more like i don't even i don't even know like how to say like a tv special a tv sp- a two part tv special yeah that's what it looks like starring kiaki zaka 46s like that's the cinematic Yuka Sugai and Akane Moria. yeah looks pretty dramatic um, mm-hmm. S- song isn't like one i listen to all the time mm. is is the it's, book Night on the Galactic Railroad, because that's different from Galaxy Railroad. Oh, let's see. Night. Yeah, by that's Kenji Miyazawa. Yeah. Two different books, my friends. Well, which one is it? So, Night on the Galactic Railroad. Milky Way. Classic Japanese fantasy novel. Nine chapter novel. Uh... Knights on the Galactic Railroad. I mean, it was still adapted into an anime. <laughs> so, like everything. But this one features cats. Ooh. And not an actual train. You guys read the synopsis? No, it's long. Giovanni <laughs> is a boy from a poor family. Uh huh. Because I'm Googling pictures for the Galaxy Railways. And it does. I do not think this is it. <laughs> okay, so it's night on the Galactic Railroad. We'll go with that. Yeah. How's, how's I'll read that? some underlined parts that I found on Twitter. Thanks to Ginga Tetsuro. Um, the underlined parts in the summary is noticing that Campabella is all wet. Giovanni asks 
what happened? And Capabella says he's not sure, but a flashback showing him drowning suggests otherwise. Skips a couple. That it's um, probably that then. Northern Cross and other stars in the Milky Way. Skip a couple more. Leaving only Giovanni and Capabella in the train, Giovanni promises Capabella they will go on together forever. Skip a little bit. Giovanni awakens alone on top of the hill. And going a little bit forward is a... Uh, but everyone still wanted to believe from that from somewhere among those waves, Campobello would appear and say, boy, did I ever swim? Right. So Akanen was swimming in the video. So that's probably it. Mm-hmm. Mystery solved. We Good job, guys. We did it. Uh-huh. Such is the power of the god emperor, Jimu. <laughs> he has an 86%. On Rotten Tomatoes, if you want to watch Ooh, that shit, must be good. Uh, yep. So uh, yeah, that's 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 all the music videos from Kuroi Hitsuji. We don't mm-hmm. have the Hinata Zaka ones or Hiragana Kiyaki Zaka ones. I don't know if they're gonna get any. They, they probably will. Yeah, I imagine. But uh, yeah, so that does it for yeah. Kiyaki stuff. That was a lot. We of still have a lot very, of things left to go. Very J-pop. <laughs> kind of christmas song you know mm-hmm. 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 but you know sometimes you get tired of j-pop but then you know what maybe you're tired of k-pop too and all the other pops so our, our girl former nogizaka member kawamura mahiro some coming graduates out with news here? z-pop dude <laughs> we got z revolutionizing girls, a new um i don't know pop group featuring girls of uh Different backgrounds. We have Mario Roti representing J Pans. Mm-hmm. Z uh, you know, Girls. Oh my god, get out of here, Z Girls. <laughs> There's already E Girls and they are far superior. <laughs> Damn, Jimmy. <laughs> They're not even in the same market. So I don't this is kind of okay. This is this is weird. It's supposed yeah, it's that's all I can feel about it. It's supposed to be like Oh, just, we got everybody except for K-pop, have for, uh, except for Korea, because we're Z-pop. Maybe. But the see, aesthetic see, is very Korean. You see this, right. uh, like, promo mi- image with all the girls. There's one left, the eighth one. That's probably the Korean chick. <laughs> I don't, which is, it's kind of weird, because the, the, like, six of them, I guess, they have, like, a web show on YouTube. Mm. You know, we got... Car- Carlin and, and and Belle and Joanne Priyanka and Vanya and Queen and, and Jo Jo anyway uh the six of them were already formed and then Roti joined just recently right because mm. this is like we have revealed a, a hidden member like some DLC type shit so what is the original language of this it's Korean. They're they're a K-pop oh. group. Yeah, they're in okay. Korea, but they speak English to each other. Mm-hmm. Uh, oh, really? What is Roddy gonna do? International. Uh, start learning English, my hero. <laughs> yeah, because apparently there's a my there's hero a is our Z name. boys too. Oh, the male. Oh, equivalent. Yeah. So, so this is kind of weird. Um, so, do they have like I don't, I don't my like favorite K-pop stuff? Who's your favorite po- K-pop star? I'm between Roy or maybe Josh. <laughs> or, or Perry. <laughs> These are their actual names. Are you right? watching the the men's version? God damn it. Guys, no, I just I, I just didn't tell you this. The, I just scrolled I through the, the the Twitter. Oh, I Josh joined the K-pop group, but I'm part of Z Boys. Uh, <laughs> just couldn't let me enjoy my success in Nogi Zaka Fourth Gen, huh? He had to stage upstage me. Get and, uh, out of here, Z Boys. Shit. <laughs> so anyway, their I guess their uh, goal is to debut in Korea. Um, I don't care about K-pop. Let's move on. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, good luck, Roti. We wish her all the best. Sorry, mm-hmm. man. The last. Wait, does that mean she has no more SNS? I don't know. I I, I haven't know. followed her since she left, bro. Did honest. she like have an Instagram for a while? Yeah, I guess. I don't know. Never followed it. Oh. So, uh, yeah. I mean, hopefully she does well. This is this is a weird move to me. Uh, hope I. I mean, I can only wish I mean, for them to be successful. Ooh, yeah. Uh, no, sorry. She updated her her Instagram. Now it says 
Nice to meet you. I'm Mahiro of Z Girls from Japan. Nogizaka 46 graduation. Graduation. Z pop dream. Translating with English. Yeah, I don't know. Did she want to be yeah. a K pop star from the. I don't know. Nogi doesn't maybe, shake their maybe, booty enough, so. Or maybe, you know, she wants to show off her, her vocal chops or Ooh, something. Oh, that's what I was thinking. Mm-hmm. Fair. Yeah. Um, yeah. Mm-hmm. I'm, I'm hoping that's the case, but either way, I'm, I'm not a big K pop guy. I wish though. them the best. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Not going to follow them, though. Yeah. Good luck. Who knows? Maybe w- watch their debut would be like a banger, dude. And oh, like, and then be like, okay, that's cool. But the thing is, yeah. like, with, with some <laughs> K-pop okay, songs, cool. like, I like the songs, but I'm never into the group. The 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 only K-pop group I was really into is Kara, and Kara disbanded mm. a long time ago. So. Anyway. Yeah, I, I don't know. the aesthetics is I, I can see the appeal. It's just not for me. Mm. But anyways, let's let's move on. Let's um, keep going to some real Nogizaka news. Mm-hmm. <laughs> We have a graduation oh, no. announcement. Oh no! This is the first it, of the year. Years are coming. Am I wrong? From Nogizaka or from Sakamichi series? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, so Etomisa announced her graduation from Nogi. Oh, oh no! I'm crying so much. <laughs> uh, I switched too early. Sorry, Josh. The- oh, no. <laughs> no, <laughs> now, I, now I just sprayed my mic <laughs> on the water for no reason. My bad. We didn't plan it out uh, well. Anyway. Nah. Etomisa's graduating. Her last event will be March 31st for a Kairi Michi handshake. But she'll uh, uh, she's going to have a uh, solo concert on the 19th, which is interesting because no one's had that before in Nogizaka, right? Yeah. Right. Yeah. Right. 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 So we got to change our award and shit, right? Like our end of the no. year is the sexiest member. It will always go. Always. It will okay. always be the Etomisa award. Uh, that award season. will be retired. It'll like the jersey will be pulled up the rafters. Ooh. No, because someone else has to come, just like they did the Holy Mother one. The I'm number, sure. the number will be retired. Mm. Right. Yeah, dude. Uh, there was only one etu, dude. Yeah. So yeah, she wrote a blog post. Mina san he. Oh. Itsumo onshite kure whatever. I can't read Japanese. Uh, watashi etumisa no exact forty six so. Sotsugio Shimas. <gasps> the dreaded face. kanji. <clears throat> um, at the end, she posted a very nice picture of herself wearing red. So nice. I mean, she's, you know, she's getting old. She's up there. Yeah. yeah. Time to do other shit. Third oldest member, right? I want a, a husband. So. <laughs> yeah, dude. She's uh, 26 already. Oh, man. Mm-hmm. Yep. She's Mayan's age. So. Mm-hmm. Um, Best of luck. Mm-hmm. Hopefully she stays in the show because we want to see more of her. Yeah. At the very least, I hope she opens an IG. Oh, At the very she least, will. I hope she makes a video with us. And I hope her IG's... Li- I mean... Uh, <laughs> what? Full it's of drinks. I hope it's lewd as fuck. Oh, no. Jimmy. Like, oh, no. Jimmy has, <laughs> has kind of came out. <laughs> uh, well, okay, no. That's the thing. I, I feel like Eto Misa's like sexiness wasn't a very lewd one it was mm-hmm. more of like so demure yeah, how a, she carries herself yeah, mature right? mature sexy it was good yeah, i like Ugh. i just want her insta to be full of like drinks konya mo biru des or whatever the fuck <laughs> oh. <laughs> just every day konya was stout oh you know okay. she's like she'd come home after a long day or whatever and just like chug beer ah oh, that's great right mina Chocoreto stout nonda koto aru. Oh, uh, that's her Insta live. Uh, Konyo, uh, kono be- she's gonna be a beer reviewer or some Ooh. spirits Dude, reviewer type Misa, of shit. Misa, hit us up. Let me produce the show. I will. <laughs> you guys can go ahead beers. and support us I, on we Patreon. The, I, we've got the camera equipment, except the lights, and we'll just have Misa <laughs> reviewing different beers. Yeah, uh, that's every Nogi fan's dream is to. You know, go out drinking with Eto Misa. And uh, maybe you have a chance after she leaves. If you guys want to support us on Patreon, we can accomplish this dream. Wow, so, such lofty One dreams, Josh. One day. One day. Uh, she has, like... You know, money that's, is how you the only thing, that's how you take out the, the loan. the only thing keeping us back, right? <laughs> with enough, it's not, with the, you take it's out not the industry loan connections the or anything like that. the commercial earlier, you take out that loan, and then you <laughs> then we're able to drink. That's, that's all you, bro. 
<laughs> um, Anyways. Yeah. So she has like a little over a month. Um, yeah. Before she leaves. Best of luck on uh, all your future endeavors, Eto mm-hmm. Misa. We'll that stay is, in touch. Uh, it's so quick, man. Uh, the ones who you have a message for Eto Misa. Uh, you know, the ones who aren't Nishino Nanase. They'd be like, "All right, I'm graduating mm-hmm. at the end of next month." Mm-hmm. Yeah, dude. We, we I feel like we reported Nanase like ages ago, and mm-hmm. then it's gonna be this weekend, yep. right? And no, then Eto Misa just announced this week, and she's so. like, "All right, I'm gonna see. You. I'm gonna dip out in a couple weeks. Be good, mm-hmm. guys." Yep. Mm-hmm. No, your seventh birthday is this weekend. Yeah, who's dude. gonna oh who's gonna be the next sexiest member, man? Oh man! <laughs> <laughs> this is Yoda Yuka. Ah yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, small but sexy. No. <laughs> <laughs> and it, it can't even be present day Yoda because uh, like she just she she retired that. No. It has to be mm-hmm. debut Yoda Yuki. <laughs> we we all know Umezawa can take over. It's fine. Oh yeah, oh. she can she can take over for Misa and Mayan, dude. It's fine. But does I don't know? It's just she just needs I, a I little more character brewing. Uh, yeah. Well, I just okay. Like she has the looks, like, right? Mm-hmm. That's like that's. But like I just I want to see a member mm-hmm. come to carry themselves like Eto Misa, mm-hmm. like the fine lady, you know, like. Like I don't know the way she like teases people and the way she like cares like oh I love watching when um I think it's happened in a few instances already when she like teases little boys like hey, you have a girlfriend yeah <laughs> yeah dude it's so good Python please don't do this yeah like please tease me what <laughs> wait what <laughs> anyway um yeah you got some more graduation news yeah oh dude. no Ito Karin has graduated. From Shogi, Shogi Focus. Focus. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so this is the regular show that she's on about Shogi. Mm-hmm. I uh, never watched this, to be honest. Same? I think I watched one episode, but I couldn't understand it. <laughs> well, you know, it's Shogi. Uh-huh. Yeah, I don't really follow the... I don't really know the rules of Shogi to begin with, so... Mm-hmm. I'm not going to get it through a language barrier. Yeah. Um, so yeah, she made a blog post and like, yep, I'm I'm out from Shogi Focus. This game no longer interests me. No, I don't know what she said. But uh hopefully she uh I don't know. Maybe she got more time to watch Nogi Chu now. Oh yeah. <laughs> Give Karin more things to do, guys. hmm This might be an impending grad announcement. I don't know. <sighs> The biggest international Karin Woda already accepts it. Mm. Shout out to Nard. Yeah, dude. So anyway, I don't she's know. just uh, you know she's just closing all the loose ends, dude, before the real deal. Yeah. Or maybe she just got tired of fans shipping her with the dude. Ah, true. Or maybe actually... it would be improper for them to date if they were on the show together. <laughs> So she's like, you know what? Let me let me just leave the show so we can do this legit, dude. Right? You got me. Are people shipping them a lot? Mm-hmm. Okay, I don't want to say shit because like someone's gonna like Take hear that, that and be context. like, oh, Ito, Ito Karen left her show just to date the guy. Mm, we got proof here. I think it's a it's a <laughs> running joke within Karin's fans. Mm-hmm. We're like, you should just get married to that shogi guy or whatever, right? Isn't that what they talk mm. about or some shit? That's what I yeah, heard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but yeah, Karin was on Shogi Focus since. Uh, 2015. That's been a while, huh? Mm-hmm. Um, so, best of I mean, she's not graduating from Noizaka, so we'll still see her around. Hopefully. I don't know what's going on behind the scenes, <laughs> so I can't tell you any more mm-hmm. than that. Uh-huh. That's all we know. Let's so, keep going. Uh, yeah. Kakegurui season two trailer yes uh for the the live action drama right season two will have nogizaka's matsumura sayuri yeah we 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 talked about this a little while back but now mm-hmm. there is a full-on trailer where you can see uh the the princess apple herself mm-hmm. yeah uh she plays an interesting character um uh, where you know they're all students in a school or whatever 
Yeah, um, they all gotta gamble and shit. Matsumura's character mm-hmm. is the idol, like a literal like amateur yeah, idol. Yeah, yeah. You can uh, see like dudes with the the fucking all the light sticks and shit like that cheering, like oh my god. Mm-hmm. You, so I guess you this, sense. this arc is when um, the main character makes like a a duo with Sairingo's character as an idol. But then, like, mm. Sairingo's idol character is, like, all two-faced and shit, right? She mm. looks all nice as an idol, but, like, behind the scenes, she's like, why the fuck are these fans sweating more than I am? They kept fucking <laughs> yelling and shit, can't even hear me sing. Just <laughs> like real life, am I right? Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> Have you guys seen that shit? It's so funny. Um, so, uh... What is it? Kyocera Dome, right? That's where Nogizaka is. Uh, oh, yeah. I saw that, dude. Where there's like the, the signs and shit like that, dude. Like, So there are signs and shit. Gachi Koi Kinshi, dude. Like, don't do this. Don't do that. And all that stuff. Ore no Yome Kinshi. <laughs> um, it's pretty funny. I thought that was hilarious. Japanese is Twitter all- is like... <laughs> <laughs> we can't do shit, dude. See, no, yeah, no mad love shouting. Yeah, no, no, he <laughs> said no, no, ore no yome. <laughs> dude, I complained what? about this last episode. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We just talked uh-huh. about it. Yeah, Fuck. that's funny as hell, dude. Like, damn, dude. It's uh, it's the end of an era, man. Yeah, dude. No ore no yome. No, he. <laughs> Hi, say no, uh, no mad love shouting. Ah, uh, damn, no gachi koi, dude. Yeah, no gachi. I love that. That's gachi koi, dude. It's mad love Rip, shouting, dude. Ah, uh, that's funny as hell. I only, yeah, you know what? To be fair, I only ever do gachi koi calls to be annoying. Like at the at the other group concert we went to. I mean, it's <laughs> I, it's fine. Like, you know, you're not, 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 I'm not trying to be annoying, but like, you know, I'm just having fun. I don't really yeah, actually. Yeah. To me, well, know. that's what they're doing too, Jimmy. I know that's what I'm saying, but yeah. I get that it's obnoxious, is what I'm trying to get at. Mm. You know, like, to me, it's it's fine. Dep- like depending on the song, right? Obviously, for the hype songs uh, that call for it, then yeah, you know, like uh, mm-hmm. Team Eight song, right? Yonju Narano. Oh, mm-hmm. right, that literally has a gachikoi part. That's like that's what yeah, the song yeah. is known for, right? So mm-hmm. that's cool. But if you're gonna do that during like synchronicity or some shit, that doesn't fit <laughs> at all, dude. What the hell? Uh-huh. Hi, 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 Taking yeah. that shit seriously, yeah, dude. Kia Saradome's like, nah, dude. Yeah, it sucks because it's just like a flat no. Because I feel like it does add to the performance for certain songs, right? Like you said, like yeah, that's like the atmosphere really of an there. idol show, right? Mm-hmm. But I feel like a lot of Nogi songs just don't fit that. <laughs> sure. Like yeah, the way they're does. made or they're written, it just doesn't fit the whole idol live thing, right? It, it doesn't, Fair enough. It's not like the traditional idol songs. Yeah. Whatever. It's not mm-hmm. like a lot of songs from the other group. Yeah, exactly. So. Except for Dunkinshin. Oh, yeah. That's but like, yeah, oh, that's oh, like, sure. yeah, obviously no, I mean, they, they those have, kind of have, songs are made for yeah. that, right? So. Mm-hmm. Yeah, like, I don't know, okay, A-side wise, you can have like Chico Chude, Iko, right? But like, how often do they have songs like that? Yeah. Right? Like once a year, really, at the most. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. But uh, anyway, going back to Kakegurui Season 2, there's a trailer. Oh, yeah. Matsumura's character is in it. Finally, get oh, some sorry, visual. That's what we're talking about. <laughs> yeah. um, Hamabe Minami looks nice, too. Mm. So, they do an idol group together. They I might didn't release watch the a anime, single And I didn't watch this show, so. Same. Probably not going to watch this season. <laughs> sorry, sorry, Same. Ringo. Sairingo mm-hmm. won't change anything. Mm-hmm. So, uh, I will probably see, like, you know, clips on Twitter and whatnot mm-hmm. of that stuff. Um, let's, let's go to the last thing. Ikuta Erika's photo book, which we just did a giveaway to. Congratulations on the winner. Um, Oricon has reported 300 
thousand copies sold after one month. Oh my god, what is happening? The Ikuta lewd was more powerful than expected. This is uh, it makes sense. It's it's just all the lewd people just waiting for her to become an adult. <laughs> all these years I've watched her. A young Ojo Sama from Germany. But now But now she's an adult in Japan in an idol group. Oh my god, it's time. Oricon reports three hundred thousand copies <laughs> for a photo book intermission. <sighs> Shirashi Mai's <laughs> passport is at 370,000 after two years. Ikuta Erika's just gonna beat it in like three months. We can't have this. <laughs> we, need, we need a third photo book. Mayan can't lose. Come on, man. These lewd boys. You know who bought Mayan's book? A bunch of young girls who look up to a goddess. Ikuchan's gonna, you know, I, all the people who bought Ikuchan's book are just a bunch of lewd boys. We can't have this. Oh, come on, come on, come on, dude! It's already uh, <laughs> buy more copies, guys. There's already enough Ikuchan photo books in circulation to give one to everybody in French Guiana. Wow! And that's or what boy French is going to do Polynesia, exactly right dude. now. <laughs> <laughs> Their photo books combined is enough to give one to everybody in Macau, dude. Oh, Jesus. This is getting into, like, real country. Oh, yeah, I should say real country, but, like... <laughs> real country. <laughs> pretty large country territory. Not like those fake countries, right? Like, we're, we're in the 100s, not the 200s anymore. Mm. Mm -hmm. Like, for highest population. I feel like this is the ceiling for photo books. Like, the... the yeah, I, I don't think anyone's... Do you think anyone's going to surpass for like, solo photo book? Like, I don't think Mayan's third book can even, like... Surpass her second one? She's going to actually so have well. to, like, post... Like, like actually have nudes in it, dude. It's the only right, way. Because, because it's Mayan's book. But then book. that'll take out the casuals, right? Maya, yeah, Mayan's book sold so well because of the casuals. So I don't, I don't know, man. I do not know. It feels like this is... As good as it's gonna get, as far as sales. Well, I don't know. I, I'm just I'd like speculating. Them to reach enough, one of them to reach enough to populate all of Luxembourg. Oh, how much how is that? That's uh six hundred k. That's 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 double, man. That's double. <laughs> yeah, that's also, I want to see one of them reach that. It's double. I'm just saying, Ikuchan hit hers in like two months, three hundred k. So you're saying we I need mean, to slow down shoot? quite a bit, but I'm just saying, you know, like, we'll who knows? see. Maybe, maybe we'll keep getting news of like, oh, on its like fiftieth reprint, dude. Yeah, I don't know. It's good because the thing is, like, it's the member, right? That's why. Um, mm -hmm. And as far as the members go, Shirashimai is the one. But like, Ikuchan, I believe, you know, I, I feel like it's because she, you know, she grew up, right? And people mm -hmm. are like, oh yeah, look at this mature version of this but i mean it, it wasn't mode. like there wasn't lewds in fucking uh 10 10 what was show? first one 10 show yeah yeah but she was like much younger than i don't know it's true people well, want to see 18, a more right? mature look uh true can we what? see a etomiso for a book as a going away present oh that'd be nice like a post because it's already I feel, too i feel soon. like her her last one didn't do that well. Mm -hmm. uh, Tommy says, "Yeah, um, okay, it didn't do as well as I thought it would have." Mm -hmm. See, we have a pre, post, current. Now we need a post. Okay, yeah, that's all we need. Let's get on it. If you guys can donate to, on Patreon, <laughs> what? <laughs> uh, anyway, that's that's it we for the current events. Time. That was a, that's a long episode already, guys. Yep. Time for a TV show roundup. This is where we Real recap. <laughs> we recap the weekly TV shows mm -hmm. of three. Uh, Hinata show, Hirgana Oshii, which hasn't changed, by the way. Mm -hmm. uh, Kiaki Zaka show, Kiaki Te Kakenai, and then Nogizaka Kojichu. Obviously. Mm -hmm. Nogizaka 46. Hiragana Oshii. 
Iguchi Mao Snack Bar returns. However, I wasn't really paying attention. And to be honest, there's no re- like write up for it. Mm. And so. Because none of us really watched <laughs> it. This week, we had. So, like, here's the premise of Iguchi Snack Bar thing, right? You, they mm-hmm. basically introduce, like, intro a member from the group. Mm-hmm. And each time a member comes, they have, like, Nayami, right? Like, something they're concerned about. Yeah. They ask for advice to the patrons there, which is only Wakabayashi. But it's Iguchi Mao. She's the mama. She's the owner of the bar. There's Miyata Manamo. She's a part-time worker. And then host Master Audrey's Kasuga is Ooh. the bartender. And then Wakabayashi is the regular. So it's the four of them. And then a member comes in and they talk about stuff. And for this episode, they had Takase Mana. And I don't remember what her thing was. Let me try. Nope. Uh, and then we have Higashimura Mei. Mm. She, Mei, uh, Mei. Oh, they brought out a doge for Higashimura. Oh. Ooh. She either wanted one or that was her dog. And it was a cute dog. And then Katoshiho, uh, where they... Uh, ooh. <laughs> there was something interesting there, but I just don't remember ooh rip so uh, I think they've gone through most of the members now yes they've done it a couple times now. they might have a few left of course Kamimura Hinano hasn't done it because she's the new member mm. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I don't think Kumi's been on there either well she if she was it was back before it was its own actual thing maybe yeah, yeah. so um they're they're almost oh I remember a thing from the episode so it was supposed to be like Valentine's right and so mm. in the canon of the snack bar storyline <laughs> uh-huh. uh, the bartender Kasuga has a crush on Mama Iguchi mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Um, but Iguchi made like chocolate like this giant heart shaped chocolate for Wakabayashi. Ooh, of course because she likes him because he you know he's the regular he keeps coming to the bar mm-hmm. so it's like oh i gave I gave you a present here you go and kasuga's like bruh getting all jelly <laughs> and he's like oh shit look at over there guys there's a ufo and everyone's like wait what so they're all looking out the window and he takes the chocolate and he like stuffs oh. it in his mouth <laughs> there's like still like a huge chunk sticking out and walk up she's like Yo, what? how could you what where's the chocolate <laughs> wait it's in your mouth what the fuck bro <laughs> so that's the funniest part of the episode <laughs> at the end here's another thing i remember it was very nice uh is uh it showed everyone's reaction to the name change to hinata zaka because mm. uh in the showroom stream it was only a few of them right like kumi and saito kyoko kosaka now but the rest of them the rest of the group, they were doing stuff too. Like some of them were at dance lessons, some of them were at the office, mm. and it's not like they were all separated. And so, uh, yeah, it had everyone's reaction to the at the announcement. Nice. I, I thought that was nice. Uh, I'll probably give the episode a watch. If, a, if anything, week. you just just watch the end part where it shows their reactions. Well, I I also wanted to add this, like. Uh, you know, I never, I never say a member, I think looks weird, until after I think she stops looking weird. Uh-huh. That's my personal rule. It's a commitment I've made to myself. It's like, oh, now you that know? she's all glowed up, I can say whatever I want. <laughs> yeah. So I used to think Higashimura looked kind of weird. Me? Yeah, May May. Like I don't know, man. It's like she's got a really big mouth. You know what I mean? I see what you mean, but I yeah, also know a lot of- where you're going with this. But now I'm like, mm. May May has been looking real cute, dude. It's I think really, it's the hair color, like the brown the hair color, really like yeah. brought out, like, mm-hmm. right. And now I don't know if I like her really big smile, like her really toothy smile, like it's like really endearing, you mm-hmm. know. She's also weird like, as fuck. That's why. Yeah. Oh, that's true. <laughs> no, that that's true. Like I I did skim some old Hiragana episodes, and I was like. I don't know. It's like there are times where I'm like, her weirdness is like, 
I and think, then the other times I'm like, I compared her right. to like Rika one time, I think, because they like they're like mm. super quiet, and, mm-hmm. and yeah, so yeah, yeah. when you know hosts of both Kiaki and Hiragana shows, they would like ask her stuff or ask them stuff. They would both be like, mm. or then backstage, <laughs> and then the host would be like, uh, what? <laughs> yeah. So, I think I think ever since they kind of. Uh, this wasn't the turning point. Oh, it was okay. It was the turning point, but it wasn't when I was like, okay, I think she's like really pretty now. But when they mentioned like how good of a dancer she was, mm-hmm. for me, I think that was when I was like, hmm, this girl can do something. Okay. <laughs> well, I always thought her like rifle thing was cool. Uh, oh, that's right. Yeah, uh, she did do the rifle the color thing, right? guard thingy. Yeah, mm-hmm. and then her shoe came off. And she- <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, but anyway, but, that's uh, Hiragana Oshi. Go check mm-hmm. that out later. So, watch it for Mei Mei for Mimi. Mm-hmm. Yeah, there was a cute dog with her. It was cool. Mm-hmm. Anyway, next show is Keaki Te Kakenai. Is Kanji Keaki Zaka. Oh, there's, that's not a label anymore. It's just Keaki Zaka now. Ooh, finally, we can just say <laughs> Keaki Zaka. <laughs> Liberated. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, this is their regular show. And so we're continuing the introductions of second gen members. Mm, yeah from last week uh mm-hmm. so first we have fujiyoshi karin from osaka another one um and uh yeah she's cute when she came out she was like crying because she was all nervous and stuff oh yeah she's trying to introduce <laughs> like oh, I'm from osaka i'm so i'm, so, I'm 17 and like, oh you're right <laughs> so she was like man you, i bet you were pretty nervous back there waiting huh she was like yeah i was, I was, I was gonna throw up dude <laughs> yeah it's like oh you can't be talking like that as an idol dude. <laughs> but uh, i got her to relax a little bit you know mm-hmm. uh like in their survey thing or questionnaire she said her favorite comedian is kuki but the way she wrote <laughs> the ku in katakana yeah, it looked like wa looked like a wa right. and they're like oh you're so your favorite comedian is waki, waki. <laughs> She's like, no, it's not. <laughs> so uh, defensive about it. It, it. Suchi was so like excited to talk about yeah. <laughs> Waki, dude. He was like, oh, oh man, this girl's into that obscure old shit, dude. All right. <laughs> and she's like, no, nah, dude, it's kooky. And he's like, oh. Both are funny in their own way. Waki has mm-hmm. had an encounter with Kiyakizaka a while ago mm. in that mm. uh, prank show. But anyway, she was like, ah, my cheeks are elastic, bro. Check it out. So Sugai and Habu are like, huh, let's see. Truly. And they're like pulling on it. And they were pretty like. Yeah. I, mm-hmm. She kind of has like, you know, it. like the, the the way her face is shaped. It's like, mm-hmm. it's cute, man. Like I got fat cheeks, but they don't stretch out like that. Yeah. So they were like tugging on it. And so, oh, look, it's so, mm-hmm. it's like tapioca. All right, whatever, Habu. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> Saying the weirdest <laughs> shit. <laughs> yeah, dude. <laughs> <sighs> So anyway, Mahabu, dude. Like one of the things she, I guess, was worried about, like, oh man, I can't really smile, you know. I have mm-hmm. trouble like smiling at the camera and whatever. She got, I got that resting bitch face. Dude. Yeah, and so, ah, <laughs> like, oh, bro, it's cool. Senpai will show you how to do it. And so they're like cutting to girls, like Sugai. She's like, oh, which camera, bruh? Looking around, mm-hmm. and you know, they're all smiling at the camera. Mm-hmm. And she, it cuts to Moria and Moria's like <laughs> <laughs> Who do I gotta kill? Who, do, who am I who am I killing? But then the That's smile is like, yeah, oh that, damn. That dude. smile though. Uh-huh. Yeah. Mm-hmm. They're like, bruh. That was kind of scary, the- man. <laughs> That's your resting face? <laughs> she had the broadest gap, dude. <laughs> right. And so yeah, they cut through more members. You know, Uemu was cute. Mm-hmm. And then it goes to Suzumoto, and she's like, uh, no, no. I was like, cover her. No. Yeah, this. It's like, uh, I'd rather. Dude, okay. Is it just me? I'm getting concerned for Mon, dude. Is she, she getting too she self-conscious? Okay? Mon's just not that kind of girl, man. That's fine. Just let me know, Mon. All right? Mon's just, I'm, uh, I'm worried about you. You just, you you just one, one Sakamichi group over. Yeah, like, if you look back to, like, early K. Kiaki te kakena. It's not even the mm-hmm. same person. Yeah, right. Yeah, dude. That's the part that concerns me. Uh, I'm like, what happened? If okay, if she's just like that's who she wants to be. That's yeah, that's fine. I'm cool with it. But if I'm like and this is just me tin tin foil hatting it, all right? But I'm like, did something happen, Moan? Do we need to talk? It's like, like did someone did someone do something? Huh? Like they all changed, man. They're not like 
You yeah, know? but Mon's change makes me worried, dude. I think, I yeah, know. like hers is the most because she's maybe she just really hates some of it. <laughs> she's no longer the like the member I came to like who almost became my Oshi man. She's not mm. like she doesn't like act that way anymore. I'm pretty she's sure she's still the same person. I mean, like the way she, yeah. uh, she is she not slope gasm anymore. She um no obviously yeah, she hasn't not. slope gasm didn't since the best timeline Futari Saison. <laughs> I'm telling you, we're living in an alternate universe. Futari Saison was the turning point. But yeah, oh like the God. way she carries herself on on their show, is not like the same mm-hmm. person. Oh, it doesn't. Yeah, you know, her. They change yeah. her character. Obviously, Suga is yeah. not the like rich princess anymore. She's just the goofy. Yeah, Pon Kotsu mm-hmm. captain, captain, right? You know, they all changed. Yeah, it's mm-hmm. just. I'm yeah. I'm just, just you know. If that's who I'm just saying, if that's who she wants to be, I'm supportive and I'm happy. I'm just as a fan, like a casual fan watching from the sidelines. It just I don't know. It feels off watching her sometimes. You know, <laughs> I'm like, why mm-hmm. is this girl so? Like man, fuck this shit, you know. <laughs> that's that's Kayaki, dude. Yeah, that's true. See what everyone thinks Techi in real life is. I feel is more now. <laughs> you know, like how everyone thinks Techi is like that character she portrays. See that never really uh, that's... sits with anyone with Techi, right? Because there's always the mm-hmm. third week of the month where the girl's yeah, locks yeah. brings back Yurina the Hirate. True, yeah, mm-hmm. I miss that girl, dude. So. But yeah, because you know, like everyone's like, you know, like there's there's Techi the perform like the character who she played, like she plays on like in music videos. But mm-hmm. then there's Techi like IRL, who's just this like cute little kid who like, oh look at these cute fucking sea otters and shit, dude. You know? <laughs> uh-huh. But um, yeah. So uh, I mean, they gotta, I feel they gotta like portray long, like an image. Right. Yeah, I mean, if that's yeah, it, okay. Dancing demons in the chat. He's he is a Mon Oshi, so I will take his word if that's just her character. Is she just aloof? Mm. I'm good with it. I'm good with it. I'm kind of excited to watch Keaki House, which is going to be the Ooh. Blu-ray content on Kuroi Hitsuji, their upcoming single, because that Give it to me, is dude. probably that's, the, the real, real people? people behind the emo and the angst of mm. their Yeah, dude. Videos. Instead of another drama, I, w- I just want like a Terrace House Kayaki show, dude. <laughs> That'd so, be interesting. Um, anyway, let's keep going here with more members. We have Matsuda Rina next. This is Josh's favorite. Mm, this is my from, first impression. Uh, she's from Miyazaki. Mm-hmm. She's the one who used to work at a bank. That bank teller. And her, her little intro uh, selfie thing. She like, tries playing her guitar. <laughs> uh huh. She like keeps messing up. She's like, oh, uh, man. but she leaves it in the whole time. Mm-hmm. <laughs> man. Do you know why? Because she knows what she's <sighs> doing. I knew. I knew. I picked the right one. This girl. Shout out to our boy. Good enough subs in the the subs for this dude. That like uh, that's right? exactly how he translated what uh <laughs> what uh Tsuchi says when uh-huh. she walks out. He's like, oh, this girl looks like she knows what she's doing. I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> nice. <laughs> uh, cool. <laughs> uh, that's but, perfect uh, translation. Yeah, she gives off like the vibe where you know she's very like uh, self-aware. Yeah, right? yeah, yeah, yeah. Self-aware is mm-hmm, mm-hmm. is a good word or description, <laughs> I guess. So she was like, "Yeah, I used to work at a bank. I can handle money. Look at this shit." Mm-hmm. And she's all like doing the mm-hmm. counting and like the mm-hmm. however the hell you hold bills, you know? Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. Like, okay, you can do it this way. <laughs> mm-hmm. yeah, like this, yeah, like over like here, that. we just do it like we'd handle cards. One, two, <laughs> but over there they got like some weird way of like folding. I don't know. Mm-hmm. So they're like, okay, uh, that's cool. Let's can you let, let's race and see who who can count the shit and get it right the mm-hmm. fastest. Right? And so they're like, oh, Nagasawa kun, please call. Like, Is she okay? She just got hit in the head. I don't know. If she's- yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right, can't she count anymore? <laughs> Nagasawa kun. Flashback like, to last um, week's episode. Yeah. yeah. She's like, oh, I'm chill. My mom used to work at a bank, so I know some mm. things. They're like, okay, cool. Mm. Pick someone else then uh, to do it with you. And she's like walking around like... <laughs> okay. well, it's holding your neck. <laughs> like, how, what? Why are you walking like this? It's not like an idol. Uh, so they... Uh, she chooses uh, yeah. <laughs> Sato Shiori. And so they go mm. and they race and they count. And then Matsuda's like 
screwing up like oh, i'm holding it wrong <laughs> but she gets it right anyway in the end because the mm. other two guess wrong yeah. mm. i like how so they yeah, ask you like <laughs> first i tried counting it this way but i suck at counting it that way so yeah. i just switched to the other one like are you fucking stupid dude <laughs> why'd you count it the first way <laughs> i like how she smiles uh it, mm. her like the way her like nose scrunches up it reminds me of my dad's gone <clears throat> mm. <sighs> um anyway uh they're like oh I can do this standing ovation thing. Like, so oh. stupid. And so I'm like, all right, Ozeki will do Chue's gag. Chue is a comedian that Ozeki really likes. And so you know, Ozeki's like doing the stupid shit. So like Matsu, Matsu does like, she's like doing the, the you know, uh-huh. gentle rich person clap. Uh-huh. So she she looks at the other, oh, please stand. Oh. You may stand and clap also. <laughs> and I was just like, oh, okay. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Standing all ovation, studio, guys. All, all studio claps. <laughs> that's great. Um, like, okay, that's that's cool, man. That's mm. that's it. I was like, he gets mad at her. The best part, yeah, Zeki like walking back, <laughs> but she's like, you bitch. I didn't do this because he. <laughs> Get out of the way. Uh, next girl is Matsudai Rico. She's from Tokyo. I think she's the oldest oh, one. Oh yeah? man, this girl's so fucking weird, dude. She's she's <laughs> probably the weirdest one. You know, the the rest of them, they're all pretty. They they have it together. They're all like, yeah, they're all pretty level headed. Seemingly, girls. this you know, like they at least they each have like a skill of some sort, right? Mm-hmm. This girl mm-hmm. has none of it. <laughs> yeah, like, there might be some that are a little dumb. They call themselves dumb, or some that are a little punk too. But this girl's like, dude. Okay, this girl. I saw her and I was like, I can see why they put you in Kiyaki's <laughs> <laughs> This is what they needed. <laughs> dude, she's Berika again, dude. Yeah. Uh, her- like, very, very high visuals and just like, man, what are you doing she's here? She's not quiet <laughs> like Rika, though. She has yeah, some yeah, yeah, that's what I like. That's what I like. Yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. She, she'll she retort or and stuff. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah, yeah. But, true, um, true. So she, like, you know, there's the little selfie video. Like I hi I like uh, rock bands you know, um, she's like dribbling a basketball but it's all like I don't know <laughs> if he uh, so like she left the half she left the club halfway through we yeah, so like she comes out and they're like yeah I'm pretty confident in my basketball skills like oh really when did you, did you yeah you were in the club that's cool man how long were you in the club it's like a year like in middle school though. Yeah, <laughs> like what? you didn't even do both years. <laughs> so it's like yeah, yeah, no. but they told me you know I, I had like character, you know. Yeah, They're naturally <laughs> talented. <laughs> uh, I had a lot of potential. Okay, yeah. that's cool. Like oh, I also practiced some drums. Mm-hmm. Oh, oh, great, that's cool. How, how, uh-huh. how long did you do it for? It's like you know I did like twice a month like, uh-huh. for how um, like two months. <laughs> so you've done yeah. it four, four times. times yeah. so, like, no, it's like oh, that's like not really enough to get get good. Then. Like, but you know they oh, told the people- me they told me I had character yeah <laughs> everyone in the studio is like oh my god dude what, the fuck? <laughs> what do we what do we get <laughs> what the hell is this <laughs> um, uh, she was we had the cool. stuffed animal right yeah and she was talking about like yeah her little stuffed animal that she was introducing yeah. in the video and stuff. Mm. Shelly Mae <laughs> why did you whisper it to me I don't <laughs> Shelly Mae yeah, says it again whispering yeah why are we why are we whispering that girl's so weird dude I don't know uh, like from the from it. the get go that's like mm-hmm. and, like she's just weird but like with Barry Rico like R- Rico is just okay. quiet right that's why they're just mm-hmm. like they're like mm-hmm. oh this girl's mm-hmm. kind of weird she's quiet why why won't she mm-hmm. talk but mm-hmm. this one this one she yeah, talks, one. but she's fucking weird, she's, dude. She's a strange. I, w- one. I want it to be the loudest one, just so she can be extra weird. Yep, dude. Okay, like I wouldn't say I was like, like edge of my seat waiting for it, but I was pretty, pretty stoked to see her intro because she's like the, the oldest member. You know, like I've, I've always kind of liked the older ones, and then um, mm-hmm. yeah, all this. You know, I thought, like I thought her, month, but. Yeah, yeah. She's well, I mean, the like oldest. the the other two twenty year olds are all very pretty. Like I, we talked about the last time. Mm-hmm. and then like i thought i thought her pictures were really pretty like uh mm-hmm. matsudaira's so i was like okay i can't you know want to want to see more about this girl and then i'm just like <laughs> oh I can't, no i can't i can't tell <laughs> if she's so dumb i can't support or if she's so dumb i must support you know <laughs> it's like the dilemma of an idol fan dude yeah she's a. Uh, I i feel like she's like the the 
the idle personality people kind of like or you want to see uh, her succeed assume right right? like idols aren't that Mm. smart or whatever right Mm. like kind of like airheaded and yeah, mm, yeah. Mm. ten end characters and stuff. Yeah, mm, that, that kind mm. of thing. But um, anyway, that's her. Next girl mm-hmm. is Morita Hikaru from Fukuoka. Tiny little child, dude. Um, yeah, <laughs> Super in, small. In her little intro thing, he's like, yeah, I'm, I'm good at drawing, man. Look at this uh, bird. They're like, ooh, nice. So she comes out and Saab is like, wow, she is small. Mm-hmm. Look at that. How tall are you? 149 centimeters. How tall is it in America? Five. It's like four. Four oh, eleven. Five. Four eleven or something. Four eleven ish. And so they're like, "Oh, Wimura, how tall are you?" She's like 150 something. They all oh, come over here, standing next to her, and they're like, "Wow, you look so big." And Wim was like, <laughs> "Oh right. man, <laughs> no one's ever told me that before." <laughs> oh man, I'm so happy. What the hell? <laughs> and so Tsuchi and Sawabe are like oh Habu's tall look at Habu she's 171 mm. Habu's taller than me damn it what mm. so she stands let's go she stands next to them like wow towers over so then Tsuchi mm. comes over Tsuchi's like six something <laughs> like wow look look at an old man came they look like a happy family <laughs> parents and their two kids Mm. I also like how she told the story about that she does cartwheels by herself because the floor is too hot for her feet. So <laughs> how long that? do you do this for? Uh, like an, an hour? hour? Like what? <laughs> <laughs> Just do cartwheels for an hour? What? Well, at least we know she's fit and stuff. Mm-hmm. Um, Small but fit. So her special skill. She's been practicing Wadaiko for a long time now. and so More than four times. <laughs> more than, yeah, so... She does a little showcase. Yeah, first like, oh, can you can you get this good after only doing it four <laughs> times? Oh wait, oh sorry, I'm mixing you up. With no, that's <laughs> yeah. not, not that. She's like, oh, that was me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so she's playing the the taiko and she's like, kudum, kudum, kudum. You're doing these mm. crazy like moves and shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I I was waiting for clacks though. That, I love that shit, dude. And hit the side. Oh yeah, she didn't do that though. No. Yeah, but it's all right. Maybe in the future. Yeah. yeah. Mm. Uh, so that was cool, man. Like, yeah, yeah. Um, it's the last girl, Yamazaki. Baggie, Yamazaki Ten. Uh, she's from. She's also from Osaka. There's three of them already. Uh, mm. She is the youngest. She's 13 years old, man. That's how. She is that's so how old, Rice, dude. Techi was when she. Nope. Techi was like 14, right? Uh, so. Uh, no, I think she was 13, 13? turning 14 when okay. she debuted. Yeah, yeah. So. Yamazaki Ten is the youngest one, and um, she's a uh, you know. What you'd expect a thirteen-year-old to be? Yeah, oh, thank mm-hmm. God. Right? <laughs> thank God. I was so worried when I saw there was a thirteen-year-old kid that we would get like I was like, because I'm okay. Long before Kiaki Zaka was a thing, when they were still just Tori Zaka, mm-hmm. right? And they had no members have been debuted yet and shit like that. I made some tweet like, "Oh man, I hope it's just a bunch of little emo babies." You know? Oh, look look at what exactly you've done, Jimmy. You cursed us, Jimmy. Yeah, you like, cursed us. <laughs> look at what you've and done. Then, and then so now I'm like, I saw I saw 13. I was like, it's going to be another evil baby. <laughs> <laughs> no, she's, she's a, just a, she's a rambunctious child, dude. Uh, she's a punk ass kid like every other 13 year old. In her little intro, like, check it out. I can fold my ear all weird. And she's like, fucking. <laughs> you know, and then, uh, I can eat these umiboshi. It's all sour. Mm. Uh, but I, you know. So she just eats it and they're like. <laughs> <laughs> but then it's like, oh, she's making a face. She's making a face. <laughs> yeah. She's about to, then she cuts the video. She's like, okay, that's it. It's like, yeah. oh, that bitch was in trouble. That's why she did that video. <laughs> yeah. And so, yeah, she comes out at the studio and they're talking to her. Like, wow, you're tall. Look at you. Uh, mm-hmm. I'm like, yeah, uh, I like snakes and stuff, but not, you know fluffy ones so they're showing pictures and a hamster and she's like oh no <laughs> yeah but a snake she's like yeah and then they show <laughs> the old picture of ishimori nijika yeah, oh chuckle, chuckle man. man dude <laughs> rip dude oh. nijika got pissed dude He's you like, tell fuck <laughs> man why you gotta show that shit man <laughs> fuck. fucking assholes like, come on dude we we love the choco man please <laughs> and so at the end uh like, oh, she really likes this comedy duo called Julieta. 
they do like a musical style of comedy and mm-hmm. it's like this weird routine that they do they dance very much for the youth yeah dude i don't fucking, yeah, you know, i don't fucking get i watch it with subs and i still don't fucking get that shit dude kids love that shit and so she's like yeah. i want to do it with the senpai and then you see them like first gen in the back like oh no and then like they're all down there she's like let's do it a couple times, like multiple times. Yeah, let's do it over. Mm-hmm. And they're like, what? <laughs> what? <laughs> it's like, yeah, yeah, dude, you gotta get the joy out of it. You gotta do it like Nankai Mo, dude. <laughs> so yeah, they do the routine and Senpai are like, oh, oh, like oh, what, are we, what are we doing? <laughs> what you gotta... Some were more so, into uh, it than the others. You just see Suzumon in the back. She's like so done with it. She's like... <laughs> dude, she's about to murder this child, dude. <laughs> I can't hurt a child. <laughs> <laughs> but if I have to, <laughs> don't make me do this. <laughs> um, so yeah, that she was the last member. I feel like this girl will bring happiness to the group. <laughs> yeah, dude, exactly. I had that exact <laughs> same thought. I was like, thank God, dude, they some don't, joy. Uh, they don't have anyone to spoil, right? Like, yeah, that's mm. true. We need a, we need a cute little kusogaki. In we need, here yeah, they need a on. punk ass kid uh, that you know will either like annoy. All of them, or like, <laughs> you know, help them all see the light. I hope she light. stays Kusogaki. I really do. I hope she doesn't turn. I hope she doesn't turn into me when I was fourteen years old <laughs> and just become full emo, dude. Oh no, you're gonna become Kiyakizaka, dude. Man. Oh man, that's the, you know you the got songs so far. I can play on acoustic guitar, dude. I'll tell you. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, here's well, that is it. Um, yeah, that is it well, last for. Thing. For Keakite Keakite Kakinai. Yes. But we still got One San Tachi. No Gizaka mm-hmm. Koji Chu. Mm-hmm. They're continuing. And, uh, this week. Yeah. Go ahead. Oh, yeah. I was just say, yeah, this week we're continuing on from last week's. All right. Some more of uh the broadcasting quiz of Oh, remember this, huh? The what pro- happened here? Yeah. Oh. Mm-hmm. See how how many of them actually watch their own TV show, uh, which is only three. Which is not a lot. Um, most of them just remember the actual recording. Yeah, uh, I was there. So, I remember this. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. Um, yes, so that was about me. To be honest, I didn't do a write up for this either because uh, I was busy. But they had a uh, uh, HK three back there. Oh yeah, uh-huh. Kimura oh, Kirai that was the, 3. the first one. Um, yeah, mm-hmm. Matsumura Shiraishi and Takayama, and mm-hmm. so like back in an old episode which I didn't watch, uh, they had a task of cheering up Kimura. He was all mad in the mm-hmm. in the in, in like his dressing room, so they mm-hmm. like they go back there to try to cheer him up. And then they like, okay, okay, let's play the game where uh, you compliment me or whatever. So like, yeah, not say. Line game style. Yeah, they clap and say something about him. And Matsumura mm-hmm. keeps talking about his moles and shit. And they're like, what the, what the fuck is this, man? <laughs> so the quiz cash question was like, oh, what was the next thing she said about him? And it was about mm-hmm. Hokuro or something or other. Mm-hmm. And so back in the present day, mm-hmm. like, you guys, uh, have your feelings changed about me? What the hell? It's been like seven years. Let's play the game again. So they play the game again. And like, it's the exact same compliments. <laughs> yeah, because he just watched this. So like, <laughs> I, I, like, I got a couple the, set up already. <laughs> what the fuck is this? <laughs> you guys haven't changed. Nothing's changed. <laughs> and uh, yeah, so that was. Uh, like, Takayama Taka was like, <laughs> uh, 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 <laughs> I'm trying to think of something. Yes, please. What else happened? Um, they showed a clip of the OL, Shinichi Mai, stealing water, but they oh, didn't yes. do anything with it. They didn't do anything with it for some reason. Yeah, the question was completely different. It's like, oh, do you remember this episode when Mai Chun stole water from her office? Mm-hmm. Speaking of which, there's this other one. Yeah. So that did. I feel like they had a question, but they answered like really quick or something. That was. The, they also showed the zombie, zombie Hori, but like oh, yeah. the question had nothing to do with that. It was about mm-hmm. like... It was in the same episode as the zombie Hori, Hori right? Where it's like, mm. it's like, all right, Hori and uh, Ikuta, you guys can't draw for shit. 
draw a mm. person riding a bicycle. And so the the question was mm. like, what like what was the bike drawing or whatever? And the answer was like, yeah, they wrote they drew four wheels. Yeah, both of them did. <laughs> or whatever on the bike. <laughs> Mm-hmm. And so it's like their drawings, and it's mm-hmm. it's terrible as you'd expect. <laughs> Ikutu is like, oh, uh, uh, it has like three three wheels, no four wheels. Uh, <laughs> she's like, think you're really hard. I think uh, Mukai <laughs> Mukai answered that right. Oh, that's so, that's what she said, right? Uh, oh no, because she guessed three. Oh, someone guessed three. And oh yeah, like, it was Mukai. Mukai was like three three wheels, three yeah. wheels, and then Star was like, hmm. <laughs> Mm. Four, four, four wheels, wheels. <laughs> four wheel. and then, like why, why are you giving her the point man that's not fair you give it away it's like everyone has complained uh, don't don't argue yeah. give her the point it was there's one also of them. the there's also the dragonfly one when a dragonfly went in and Nanami freaked out uh, that's as well right. as the other members so good seeing Nanami again <laughs> <laughs> that's all Josh wanted to bring up oh Nanami um, that's the only thing I want to ring of. But yeah, you know, it's it's a nice visit of older uh, past episodes and stuff. Mm-hmm. Just in case. They showed the Himuko. Oh, that's right. Of him uh, crashing their concert mm-hmm. two years ago. I like it. the part when, when Shitara uh, scares Himura <laughs> just by screaming skydiving <laughs> into, oh, yeah, the, uh, <laughs> into the mic. The members were at the venue and they were rehearsing. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh, I think they had to remember how he looks. Oh, the question was like, so uh, Himura had a few disguises so he wouldn't be found out. Mm-hmm. What, what was his disguise? What did he look like? Yeah, mm-hmm. Draw draw it. Yeah. So they're mm-hmm. like drawing stuff. Um, but yeah, that they was... A, a jump rope thing? Quiz on the jump rope? When oh, that was mad. early. Was that the one Mukai answered? I don't know. A third gen answered one of these questions and got it right. Yeah, it was Mukai. Uh they did the jump rope thing. <laughs> yeah, they had to guess why why he was mad. Oh, that's right. Oh, what the fuck he, are you guys doing, man? <laughs> yeah, I, I, I want to get more of that. I want to get like, Nabe, the, the man. <laughs> I want a hot pot and shit. It's like well, that's why you're mad. <laughs> that's why you're mad. <laughs> I want to see some of that. Like come back like out of nowhere, just like them getting mad at the members. It's always Shake funny. Up. Mm-hmm. Uh, and th- now I feel like they can retort. So like. If they get mad, they'll just get mad right back at them or something. I feel like they could do something with that. A lot of first gens will immediately retort. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. They're comfy now, you know? Yeah, they're comfy. Mm-hmm. They need to get mad at like fourth gen and third gen. No. What's the matter mm-hmm. with you? you? Can't even <laughs> jump, bro. Oh. Oh. <laughs> can't even jump. <laughs> Friggin' useless, man. Mm. Yeah. They, gotta be, they gotta do that older brother pers- persona. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So uh, that's pretty much the episode for Nogichi. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. There's more next week, guys. This continues. Oh god, one more episode. I mean, oh yeah, oh, oh yeah. I like I like watching the clips of it, but then like sometimes the questions are like, okay. I don't know, man. I'm just yeah. I mean, I like highlights and all, but just come on, dude. Give me some good new content. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Do you think it's just filler for fourth gen until fourth gen could appear? Maybe. Hopefully, I just feel like two two episodes of this was enough. Mm-hmm. You know, yeah. We're also got, used to like just two episodes, so well maybe I could have gone. I could have gone with just one, but it's fine. I'm sure. I'm sure there's this. Fun this stuff was a uh, keep it right. Like a lot of viewers, it was involved. That's why, because you know, mm, true. Yeah, because mm-hmm, mm-hmm. the the questions came from Aneta Dachi. Oh, so yeah, that's why. Yeah. I don't know. Maybe next week's was is gonna be like half of mm. than half of another set thing. Yeah. We'll see. But that's pretty much it. That's no get you. There were no other shows on that I cared to watch. So that's it. That's it. And if you enjoyed this episode, then you can go ahead and watch our other episodes on YouTube. Just look up Slope Club on YouTube and you'll be able to find it as well as other videos we've done where we interviewed different people, uh, where we've made fun little punishments for ourselves. 
and more content to come. So be sure to subscribe to that channel. Hit the little bell notification if you want to be notified every single time you get to listen to a finished episode of the podcast or a video that will surprise you. Um, you can go ahead and follow us on Twitch, on Twitter, and on Instagram because you never know what might show up on either platform. So it's safe to just be following all of them. You can go ahead and join our Discord if you want to be part of that. And if you're a subscriber on Twitch or Patreon, you get some exclusive access on Discord as well as other goodies on there. That does it all for us this week and catch us again next week, Tuesday Pacific time around 7 p.m on twitch.tv slash slope club. See you next Bang. time. Bye.